All right, TikTok, you ready? Let's go invite the rest of TikTok. All right, let's just check the camera a little bit. Let's just turn this a little bit. And there, there we go. All right, let's invite TikTok. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, TikTok. Ah, welcome, happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. How is everybody doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome. How are you? How's everybody doing? Hmm? I want to hear how you're doing. Let me know. Hello, Ebony. How are you? How are you? Happy Tuesday. Hopefully you had a really good day. I had a very good day, very productive day, but man, was it crazy raining today. But I stayed dry. I stayed home. And hopefully we're going to have some sun here pretty soon. That would be super nice. But I think that this is like the perfect spooky sort of gaming kind of weather. And I am all about that. So we are going to have our terrifying Tuesday of games. And I've got some great games for all of us. Hello, Elizabeth. So what we're going to do is on our agenda for today, we are going to do, we're going to start off with Granny. I'm just going to set the mood with Granny because I feel like, um, I just feel like running her down. So we're going to start off with, um, I just asked the Discord when you'd be on, probably remember, but I'm in the UK and it's C11. <gasps> yep, I'm here. Yay, I'm here. Hello, hello, hello. Yes, Jersey, you are early today. All right, let's let's do this. Hello, Charlie. Hello, hello, Betsy. <gasps> when I see my Betsy, my heart goes thump, thump, thump. I love you, Betsy. You just, I don't know. There's just something about Betsy's energy that just like, it lights up the room when she comes in. It's like, we're all, she just like walks into a room and it's all like, Betsy's here. So we have on today's Candace. How are you, everybody? Jasper, good afternoon. <sighs> okay, so we're starting off with Granny. I just feel like getting just jumping right into Granny. Now, I already promised you that, and I promised to myself also, Katie, hello, hello. So I already promised myself that, and I am doing really good about this. I am all about scary, and I'm all about spooky, but we are not doing really like graphically gory, scary things, and I'm not going to have any sort of content that is going to be just like, yuck, I'm not going to do it. So Granny, chasing her. She's chasing me. She's smacking me over the head. I'm smacking her back. Good old, just scary, just chasing stuff. Love it. All right. From there, we're going to go do some phasmo. We're going to just do some phasmophobia. I need to practice. I need to start. Um, uh, oh, you're going swimming. Oh, very fun, Dancing Queen. You just go and have fun. All right. So we are going to start with Granny. Then we're going to go over to phasmo because I have to. I just have to up my skill for phasmophobia. And you all are going to help me with that. So we are going to be doing this. Um, Tuesday's going really well. Really, really good. And Ebony, I'm glad that you said just mentioned that because we have a back rooms on the schedule today. Look, right there, right there. Okay, so I found another game and this one's called Death Watch. And while that sounds really like gruesome, it's not. It's in a spot, it's a spot anomaly game. So where we click through the cameras, but here's the twist is I have to come up with like a code to kind of like the, um, the ghost. But at the whole time that we're trying to figure out and find the anomalies, um, there's a ghost trying to sneak up behind me. So not only do I have to watch all the cameras, but I have to take a camera and be like, whoa, whoa, whoa. So I really like that. I played it for a little bit today. I think it's going to be a really good one. Um, I think it's going to be a really good interactive one. Yeah, it's kind of like a spot in an anomaly with a little bit more of a, a creepy 
like a creepy vibe, which I'm all about. I love that. And then um, we're going to play uh, Escape the Back Rooms. And I love that one to the very last because that one is a little bit more... Um, it's a little bit more. Kylie, thank you for hearting me. Katie, thank you for hearting me. Um, my little tulip rose flower, thank you for hearting me. So we're going to leave that one to the very end because sometimes those little back rooms can get a little technical and sometimes um, it's like I get stuck. So we're just going to leave that to the very end. And however long we play that one, we play that one. But I thought that that was really good. So again, Kayla, thank you so much for the follow. So again, just so we know what we are playing. We are doing Granny, Phasmo, Death Watch, which is a Spot the Anomaly game that I played it earlier. Looks, It was a lot of fun. And then Escape the Back Rooms. So there you go. That's our schedule. Tia Millie, thank you so much for sharing my live. I appreciate that. Kayla, 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 Kaylee, Kayla, Kayla Ann. Thank you for my roses. Sometimes I'm always so, um, I'm always so just like, I want to say your username's correct and I, I could just mess myself up. Tara, yes, I said Death Watch. Um, we, yep, we got Granny Phasmophobia, Death Watch, and then Escape the Back Rooms. So we have four that we're going to be playing tonight. Kaylee, Kaylee, of course. Okay, Kaylee, thank you. Um, I have played Poppy's Playtime. I'm not really, it's, I'm not a Poppy, I'm not a Poppy type of gal. So I am not going to be playing that one. So yeah, yeah, the games are going to be fun. They're going to be scary. They're going to be suspenseful. They are not, hopefully, knock on wood, they're not going to be gory. And we're going to have a great time tonight. Elizabeth, thank you for hearting me. All right. Um, you, I always get unalived by Huggy. Kayla, you know what? It's just truthfully, it's, it's just a matter of, um, you know, just having fun playing the game, hanging out with you. And sometimes I, I just didn't enjoy just the whole like, ch -ch 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 -ch. I don't know. It's just me. I'm not a poppy type of gal. Like I said, <gasps> V Mackie, thank you for my ducks on parade. I got a mama duck and a baby duck and I got duck zone parade all right let's go let's get huggy wuggy eats me and his sharp teeth cole i will pop him in the nose if he tries to eat you um rosa thank you so much for hurting me all right let's get going and we are going straight in with granny let's go the rain's been horrible here today mama Iris, thank you for my duck song parade. I got a mama duck and a baby duck, and I got duck song parade. So, um, oh, having a hotel night with the puppy. Oh, dang. Well, hopefully you can get settled in, and you and your puppy can enjoy it, and we'll have a good night together. But, yeah, the rain's been pretty intense here today, so I have to turn this up here really quick. Yeah, no, it was, um, it, well, there was actually, because I'm just right outside of San Diego County, and they were actually had tornado warnings today, and we don't have tornadoes in California. I have earthquakes. I do not have, I have earthquakes, not tornadoes, so then one county over was on tornado watch, and I'm just like, nope, I don't understand. I don't understand. I have to restart this really quick. Oh, no, I don't. Are you sure you want? No, because I, I can actually turn up my volume here. Okay, there we go. Is Jen here? Jen, how are you, my Jen? Yes, I live in San Diego and the flooding was so bad. I rescheduled my clients today. Bianca, yeah, no, I know like Chula Vista, El Cajon, um, they were all in uh, that tornado watch. And I, like I said, it's like I have earthquakes. That's what I signed up for. I'm okay with my earthquakes. Oh, shoot. Okay, she's running up on me, everybody. Uh, go, get out, get out, get out. Run. I really need this today, my bet. Ah, oh. you're, um, oh, Arlo. 
You know what? Okay, if anybody's gonna, if anybody is gonna drop you and get you, and just cut you out of your life, their lives, you don't. I, I know it hurts now, but you deserve to have people who always have your back. So, you know what? I'm sorry for that, and I just hope that you know that you deserve to have somebody who just loves you unconditionally, and you don't need temporary people like that in your life. So, yes. Somebody, can you all just give Arlo the gift uh, or the hug bean, please, for me? I cannot do my own emojis, but um, if we could just show Arlo some love and send some hug beans, I would really appreciate that. I think, um, you know what? It's like I keep on saying we have the most amazing community, and we don't have to physically be in the same room to care for each other and to show each other love. So I appreciate that. And I hope you know that you are loved and appreciated, seen and the all of the above here. Hello, E. Um, oh, you're, is named Arla, that's awesome. We are loved, absolutely. I mean, look at how beautiful this is. Elizabeth, thank you for my team bracelet. I appreciate you. I knew she was going to be walking through here. Look at her go. Oh, okay. So she walked back that way. And I want to go into the spider attic. Um, so I'm going to wait until I can see her leave one way or the other. I know I loved the sleepy one. And um, I kind of had a little bit of a hard time making that one because a lot of times the sleepy kind of look like 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 my bean was like three sheets to the wind and i'm like i do not want to have a bean that looks like that i just want one that looks like it's sleepy um and so i'm just like this was not that was not easy it was not easy to get that mixture of sleepiness kayla thank you for hurting me it was um so i that one took me a little bit longer to develop but i did it and so oh shit she scared at me everybody there she is again okay she's coming after me let's just let me see if i can sneak by i can Whew. all right yeah, just in case. I, I purposely did that because I didn't want any miscommunications on what my bean was doing. So it's just sleepy. That's all it is. That is all my bean is doing. Uh, the little bean. Yeah, you know what, Ebony? I actually made that one into our coffee mug. And I thought that that was so cute. I thought that that would be cute. Cute. I accidentally booked a plant-based hotel, but I've been um, so surprised at how lovely the food has been. I'll tell you what, I, I am, um, I have been a vegetarian now for, gosh, going on over seven years, and I do not miss it at all, at all. Okay, well, there she went. There she went. Okay, I see her. April, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Oh, crap. Here she comes. I thought I could sneak around, but I couldn't. So let's see her walk up here. Is she going to come up here? Okay, well, apparently she got, she changed her mind. Hello, Amy. Emery, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Kayla, thank you for my tiny diny and for hearting me. Thank you, thank you, thank you, everyone. So we do have, um, oh crap. Okay, just for, just so you know um, that I heard from TikTok today and our Discord for subscribers only, um, they are working on that one so that way um, we'll have within our discord, we'll have a little subs. I mean, I know we have a subscriber button, but it's going to be a little bit more where, um, it it's going to be a little bit more connected to the live. So they are working on that. So as soon as that gets done, 
Ah, oh, Jiminy Crickets. Can you please follow me up here so I can do this? Thank you. Um, a wed by nothing. Thank you for the subscription. I appreciate you. Welcome to my bean family. I appreciate you. You are my baby bean and I love you dearly. I'm going to get attacked by granny, but I just want to let you know I saw your subscription. You were subscriber number 1,149, but I love you like you're my only number one bean. Elizabeth Osborne, thank you so much for my ducks on parade. I got a mama duck and a baby duck, and I got ducks on parade. They go quackity quack, quack, quackity quack. Quackity quack, quack, quackity quack. Thank you so much, Elizabeth. Elizabeth, oh, oh, Elizabeth. Elizabeth, oh. Because the other day, as I mentioned, we have quite a few, I think we have like, what, like three or four Elizabeths? And I want to make sure that you all know how special you are to me. So I want to make sure that I sing to the right. Elizabeth and Gamer Girl, thank you so much for my follow. I appreciate that. I appreciate you. Wrinkle the Duck. I've never heard of that. Hello, she. How are you? Yep, nope. The rain started again, but that is perfectly okay. Look at that. Look at that bed hag just standing there waiting for me. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Okay. <sighs> I got to tell you, Granny and I definitely have a love-hate relationship. I love this game, and she absolutely loves to smack me in the head, and I absolutely um, love running her over when I get out of here. So again, an absolute love-hate relationship with Granny. Hello, wise girl, how are you? I just started my first day at my new job, though. I celebrate by supporting my favorite streamers. <gasps> well, odd by nothing. I appreciate that so much, and I'm glad that you liked your first day at the job. And congratulations. I'm really proud of you for that. Lucky Tay, oh, wow. Thank you for my mirror bloom, Lucky I appreciate you, Lucky, and I'm so lucky to have you in my life, Lucky. That's your special song. Ebony, thank you for my team racial. It's in hurting me. Can you tell I had a little bit of sugar before I started the stream? Today was a kind of like a, I think it's a good day for to make brownies. So I had a big old, um, I had a big old, piece of brownie and a glass of milk before I started my stream and I have not locked her in the um in here I I have a tendency to whenever I try to get tricky um I end up myself like that whole freezer thing I only thing I ever do is freeze myself so I don't even try to do that it's a hyper Lonnie day. It's a singing Lonnie day. It's a day for me to sing. Um, oh, you're making brownies too? I love it. Um, oh, yeah. No, Ashley, she knows I'm down here. She just can't figure out where, and that's perfectly fine with me because now I'm going to sneak back up here, and I'm going to do this, and I'm going to do this. And you know what? Some days I'm just happy and some days I just want to sing. And you know what? I am very, um, I'm very, I'm very honored and I'm very thankful for each and every single one of you. Every single one of you. And I, um, I know for a fact that we have such a unique and amazing stream here that I cannot tell you how unique this whole experience is. 
and I am so thankful for all of you. So, yeah, you know, whenever in doubt, make a make a batch of brownies, eat some, have a glass of milk, and just sometimes that's just the best way to to kind of just I don't know, just to kind of be like, yeah, you know what, it today's gonna be okay. Well, thank you, Fimaki, and, and you know what? This is a, I have a commit. I do have a commitment to you. I am. I, I I feel really responsible for making sure that we have a space to go every single day. And here's what I thought. Okay, so if if ever I'm not feeling well, or if I end up getting a cold or whatever, and I cannot um, stream. I'm still going to go live and I'm just going to, and we're going to, I'll just keep my live up while I sleep and then you all can just hang out together. I will still provide for you your spot. I just might not, uh, I might not just be partaking in it. So I already have like an emergency plan just in case I don't feel good. Um, hey friend, I just, uh, about to play some Phasma and sell you life. Yeah, I'm gonna do one round of Granny, and then I'm gonna head over there and play some also. Yeah, that's what I figured. You know what? And and that would be um, something that I would just. And thank you so much for my roses, hon. I appreciate that. And that would be a live where I would probably just do it on my laptop, and I would just <laughs> every once in a while I would respond. But that would definitely, that's my backup plan. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it would absolutely be where, you know, like I said, the only thing I would have to do is just put it on and, you know, I would just make sure you had your spot, but that doesn't necessarily mean that I would be gaming or even participating. So, but you all have to remember, um, in my corporate job, I was my own boss. I mean, I was my own little entity. So if I didn't work, nobody took care of my desk. So this kind of grind, I mean, this kind of working like I do, to me, just comes second nature. It's just something I've always done. Um, so let's see here. Bye, Cole. Are you going to be on later? Bye, Cole. Hello, everybody, again. So if you just joined Brandy, thank you for my roses. Um, but if you just joined, it is called Terrifying Tuesday, and I will be playing spooky games all night. And we're going to start off with Granny. Uh, thank you so much for my rose, hon. I appreciate you. But I'm going to start off with Granny, then we're going to head over to Phasmophobia. From there, we are going to play some Death Watch, which is a Spot the Anomaly game. And then from there, we are going to probably try out um, it's in Escape the Back Rooms. And so we are going to be doing that today. Fee Mackey, thank you for my tiny diny, which I think is adorable. And that's pretty much the plan that we have for today. Ray, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Um, is that a new game you haven't played, the Back Rooms one? Lucky, okay. I, when I first made my switch over to scary games, I tried to play that one. I got frustrated and I quit. I was playing it a little bit today and I read the reviews and it has excellent reviews. It's definitely very puzzle based with a lot of, like with some monsters. So I think that that would be fun. I am saving that one to the very end, just, be, just in case it's something that, um, just in case it's something where we're like, oh, I don't like it, you know, we, we're not losing much of our gameplay. And so we are going to do that to, at the very end. Now, the one that I did play that I thought was a lot of fun was that Death Watch. And that one, did she see me get under the bed? Gosh, I hope she didn't see me. But Death Watch is um, a Spot the Anomaly game where just like observation six but there's like a creepy ghost trying to break in so it's kind of like scrutinized so not only do we have to look at the um not only do we have to look at the monitors but we have to like look behind us and like with a flashlight just be like oh what's that what's that 
And so I thought that that would be fun too. Yeah. Yeah. Very, again, very, um, what is I'm trying to say? Very interactive for us. Because that's just what we do. We interact. Um, what, oh, what game is, this one right here is Granny. So this is one of my absolutely favorite games to play. I don't know why. Like I said, I have a real love-hate relationship with Granny. She loves to chase me and hit me over the head, and, and I love to run from her and get out of there alive. Um... Uh, da, da, da. Oh, eyes down. Oh, I don't. Yeah, probably something like that. Like I said, it kind of reminded me a little bit of phasmophobia. Uh, it also reminded me of observation duty and uh, scrutinize. So I thought it was a really interesting concept. And then also too, everybody, I have, I'm broadening my horizon off of just playing games on Steam. And I've got a couple of really cool ones I'm eyeballing. Uh, hello, Ray. Oh, yeah. No, I think this is such a good one. Um, ha, only Cats Matter. It has taken me, what, probably four months, three months of playing this pretty much every single day to get to this point. But I'm still playing on easy, so I don't even feel like I'm all that accomplished. Uh, but... I will have to move difficulties level sooner or later. I'm just not ready to do it yet. I kind of still like, I still kind of like having my little winning streak for now. Oh shoot, there she is. Let's see how fast I can run. Okay, number one, everybody. Remember the number one. Last time I told you all to remember that, I did not listen. And I ended up blowing myself up. So that was not fun. Hurry before she comes out. What is this one? Master key? Okay. Okay, so we can go. Ooh, there's a shotgun piece. So let's go ahead and put this down here because we'll need this for the front door. So I forgot I moved my clocks ahead and got worried at three. Oh! Yes, nope, if ever, if ever, ever something happens and for some reason I cannot stream, I would definitely let you all know on Discord, but I can't, like I said, I, it would have to be something like either I'm not physically here or I just don't have electricity. All right, everybody, hydration station. Rosa, okay, I'll be here all night, so just go do your chores, we'll be back, and remember it is, um, <laughs> and just remember, it's Terrifying Tuesday. And Ebony, that's got to have like extra sort of um, jump scares for you. Brandy, thank you as always. Um, and I'm going to give you her reminder. Daily reminder, take your meds, drink your water, and love yourself. I love that daily reminder. Okay, let's see, where are we going? Where are we going? I really don't wanna have to go, I really don't wanna have to go down into creepy spider central. Um, um, yes, I know, and then I'm working on adding to that, and I did put a little spot in Discord so if you have any recommendations for merchandise or anything like that, anything new that I'm developing, any updates on the merchandise, I will be updating you all on our Discord too. Yep. Um, hello, Andy, how are you? Ooh, Heather, that sounds perfect. Well, I have been seriously all about just being super comfy these days so I the only thing I did for today is I just put on my denim jacket just because it's a little bit lighter weight and I wanted to wear that and then I just put my Uggs on and I'm good to go my jeans are super oversized and super baggy 
So they're kind of like sweats, but they're not. Uh, Tarina, thank you so much for hearting me. And Rosa, thank you for my corn. I appreciate that. And Ebony, thank you for my team bracelet. Um, it says, no, my, oh, I keep you on while I do my stuff. I just said that because I said, oh, okay, good. All right. Thank you. Lucky, thank you for my duck zone parade. I got a mama duck and a baby duck, and I got duck zone parade. It's like you're my baby duck, and I'm the mama duck. And I go quack, 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 and then you go quack, quack, quack. Timothy, thank you. How are you doing today? Thank you for my heart. I appreciate you so, so much. <gasps> Miss Paige, thank you for my ducks on parade. I got a mama duck and a baby duck, and I got ducks on parade. All right, look at that hag. She put that right there. She thought I was going to run right into that, and then she was going to run up on me. <gasps> Ebony, thank you for my, my little gamer kitty. Because sometimes I, th I love that little cat. Because it's all, oops, it's all concentrating. It's like, uh, I'm going to get this. And I'm all concentrating and I'm like, ah, uh, I got to run from granny. Go, 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 go. Nothing there. Nothing there. Got a spark plug. Up oh, there she is. Run, Lonnie, run. Run your little feetsies off. Andy, thank you for my duck zone parade. I got a mama duck and a baby duck when we got duck zone parade. I'm sick. This is what I'm watching to make me feel better. Oh, Chelsea, I'm sorry, honey. I'm sorry you're not feeling well. Hopefully. Lucy, we are playing Granny. <laughs> Andy, I find myself singing that all day long. And it's like, it just makes me happy. It brings me joy. And hopefully everybody's going to start feeling better because it just seems like we have been um, just inundated with, with the yucks lately. Oh, you sing it too? That's awesome. Okay, we're going to have to have some Ducks on Parade merchandise. And so I will be working on that one. I cannot steal their exact design, but I can sure as heck make a cute one. So we're going to have a Ducks on Parade merchandise. And then nobody's going to understand what it means, but we will. <laughs> a bean duck, yeah. So we're going to have Ducks on Parade merch. Parade. If I could spell, I would spell parade. You're here for the Ducks on Parade, yes. Oh, Ducks on Parade must have your rain boots on. I love that. Ducks on Parade merch with rain boots. Thank you. I tell you, we come up with the best ideas during our, our, um, oh, Brandy, you're, we'll just have to call you a little ducky. Um, we come up with the best ideas while we're just hanging out and talking on our lives. Hello, gaming animals. How are you? Ooh, and an umbrella. Yep, we have, well, well, I will definitely work on that, and we will get some Ducks on Parade merchandise also. Oh, shoot. shoot. Ah! I tried running around. Thank you, True. Um, Lucy, I have played Granny, too. I'm not really too sure. I, I mean, I'm not, I know for a fact that I just said the wrong word. But I'm not, I have it, I just don't like it that well. Um, I've, I, I don't really care for having to run from grandpa. I mean, just because she got a boyfriend. And truthfully, okay, I'm just going to be honest with you. I'm really super jealous that this bed hag could get a boyfriend and I can't even get a stinking date. So I think I'm just, I'm upset about that. I'm just kidding. Um, 
But no, in all honesty, I'm not really super. Wah! Wah! Ah! Run with your little key. Run with your key. Don't look behind you. Um, I don't really care for the, the layout of the house. I really get grossed out over that little, um, that little baby spider. So I'm not a fan of that one. But um, I do, if I'm going to play another one, I would rather play Granny 3 than Granny 2. Yes. Okay. So what I did not know, you want some, you want some gossip? Not that it's really gossip because I think it's pretty much everybody knows this, but um, the Granny remake is from a different developer from the original Granny. So basically, they said that the original people who manufactured this game didn't patent it correctly and they made like a dupe of this one and I do not like that one at all. So that's, a, that's about as much of a gossip as I have. It's just reiterating um, some facts that somebody told me on one of my lives. Yeah, and I, truthfully, I felt really cringy playing it. So I actually returned, I returned the game because I think that that's like not cool. I mean, you can't take somebody else's intellectual property and then just be like, oh, I'm going to take it. And I just didn't like the game. The graphics were weird. The Do you like? I'm just like, stomp, stomp, stomp. Um, so no, I don't like that one. But oops, if I had to replay a game, I would do Granny 3. Granny down. And I love how absolutely dramatic she is. She's like, oh, oh no, I've been shot. Okay, so let's get this. I've been shot. Let's look in here really quick. Let's look in here really quick. Let's look in here really quick. And nothing. And nothing. Okay. Yeah. And like I said, I thought it would, because in a million years, I never thought anybody could do that. So when I bought it, I thought it was the same manufacturer. Odd by nothing. Thank you for harding me, hun. Um, I thought it was the same manufacturer, and they were just like trying to update it just to kind of make it new again. But I had no idea that somebody stole it and redid it. Oh, Rox the Fox, how in the heck are you? I'm doing well. Doing good. I'm doing good. Just sitting here playing some granny, watching the rain, and just doing my thing. We're going to have to go down to Spider Town, though, unfortunately. Oops, I forgot my key. <sighs> I do have to make indie merch. And I am looking for, okay, so get this. I looked into the squishies because I really want to make those bean squishies, but it looks like I have to, I'm not too sure if it's going to work out for us, but I'm, I have not given up because the way that the website is that I have all the merchandise through, it's made to order. So it's basically you order it, they make it, they ship it, and, you know, we're all good. But for the squishies, they're like, I would have to purchase like 500 of them and then they would make them, and I'm like, I don't know if I need 500 squishies. Oh no, run, run, run. So I'm gonna look into it a little bit more. Yeah, oh, it, Lucky, can you send me that information? I would really appreciate that. Yeah. See, that's what I'm wondering. Like I said, I have to do a little bit more research on the squishies. That's really the only one that has a question mark for me, but I have not given up at all on that. Yeah. So everybody would have to commit to like, you know, 25 squishies. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yeah. Yeah, so no, I mean, um, and just like the dog stuff, um, cause I want to do like dog scarfs and kitty cat scarfs and I want to do pet stuff. 
and that's not super friendly for that one either. <gasps> no, no. Oh. So I'm going to have to do a little bit more research on that one too. Claire, I'm glad you made it. <laughs> I, or I'll just like, you know, I, what I'll do is I'll buy 500 of them and I'll put them all behind me like in a big old squishy mountain and then it will be so tempting for you. Y'all will want to buy them. Oh, okay, Brandy, I'll be here. Yeah, I definitely want to do um, pet stuff. Oh, cool. Thank you. All right, so let's go. Let's go put this over here. All right, we only need one more picture and we get an extra day. All right, everybody. I kind of really didn't want to do this so soon, but I am... Um, Aw, she, I love that. It says, I'm back with noodles, water, blankie, and a lit candle. I think that that's awesome. And I think that sounds like the perfect way to snuggle in for, ah, for a good game of ah, gaming. Did you see that? All right, everybody. If you are Roxa Fox, thank you so much for hearting me. And odd by nothing, thank you for my team bracelet and for hearting me. Now, that was really close. Okay, I'm going to give you a little content warning right now. Uh, if you are scared of ginormous spiders that uh, look like a human that tries to eat my face, please be aware that this is down here. And also to, um, if you're like tight spaces or something like that, um, it is also to what we're about ready to do. So just letting you know. Creepy crawling warning. Exactly. Try to keep a PG-13 kind of stream here. But let me show you what I'm talking about because this right here is horrific. So... That's not my friend. She's not here to welcome me. She's not here to welcome me into the sewers. She's more like, um, welcome so I can chomp on you. Nope, 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 G nope, nope, nope. See, here she comes back. Cozy vibes for a cozy stream. I love that. Hello, Jamie, how are you doing? Do, 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 there she goes. <laughs> oh my lord, yep. Good, good, good. Hello, hello. She wants a hug. I think she wants to hug me, but I don't want a spider hug because I actually, one of my biggest phobias is spiders. So, and the only way that I can play this and not absolutely crawl outside of my skin is, oh, great, there's the hammer, is the simple fact that it's a cartoon spider. Oop, whoa, no, oh shit. Go, 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 go. And I know that it's a cartoon. So, if it's like a realistic spider, I can't do it. So... Yeah, she wants an eight-legged like eight -legged hug for sure. <sighs> it's extremely fast for being like an old lady spider. It's definitely fast. Um, oh, Andy says, I found out there is an option to turn off images of bugs on. Oh, okay. Is that the um, that home security hotline one? That was a good game. Really? Okay, Lonnie. Okay, cool. Well, hopefully you can, honey. Yeah. There's a game where we have to find spiders and cause chaos, kill it with spite. Nope. No, 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 no. 
So now tomorrow, everybody, is Wild Card. Um, it's called Wild Card Wednesday. And basically, it's going to be whatever game is going to cause the most chaos is we're going to play. So I'm thinking for sure we are going to be doing some... We're going to be doing some... Um, some untitled goose we're just gonna have a real fun kind of silly stream tomorrow and i'm super excited and i can't wait and then on thursday we're doing throwback thursdays and so it's not necessarily going to be like like um like a super low quality game or something like that but i'm definitely going to be playing some old school games maybe remastered versions or something like that but i think that will be fun also okay really seriously i just don't want a big stick i don't want a big stick i can't remember which one it was but one of the lord of the ring movies had a giant spider oh yes 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 um n the very last one the return of the king and it was shelob is the spider's name and I know that because I read the Lord of the Rings a bunch when I was a kid. And so the spider's name was Shelob. And I think what was even scarier was the, um, it was when they were in the forest. I think that was the Hobbit. And they had like all of the spiders in the trees and stuff. Yep. Okay, so let's go. Let's see if we can't. Ah! Okay. See, I don't remember the Harry Potter one. Oh, I have to suggest games for Thursday. Absolutely. If you're on Discord, put it on Discord. If not, just send me a, a DM. <sighs> nope, 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 nope. Yeah, I could do spot. I can do snakes. And truthfully, hello exotic. I can do snakes. Um, I can do spiders if they're cartoon spiders. I mean, I know in reality that Granny Spider is never going to like. I'm never going to have to shoo shoo Granny Spider out of my house. I know that for a fact. And so I can get over it a little bit more. Now the one that absolutely makes me want to throw up is the spider up in the attic on this one because it's so realistic looking and you can only just see its front legs and it scares me i don't like that one i do not like that one at all okay so let's see what we got in here i have to throw this back down eek 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 and there we go. Um, um, Golem doesn't bother me. That we, Golem never... You know what? Actually, truthfully, I felt really bad for Golem. I mean, I know he's the villain and stuff, but I just really always felt really bad. Like, you know, poor guy. He just... He got tempted, and it didn't end up well for him, but I don't know. I just always felt bad for him. Uh... Which, um, um, do, do, do. which game I, um, <laughs> this poor guy just wants to accessorize. Exactly. Um, I'm sorry. I don't remember. I, I missed the name of the game there, Rosa. I was trying to see if I could figure out what the game was that you recommended and I, I missed that one. Oh, the Golem game. I didn't know that they actually had a game. So the other day I jumped out of there and I actually, it, um, I like limped really bad and I was kind of weirded out over that. I didn't know I could hurt myself jumping down here. Do, do. I've never seen it. So I don't know. I'd have to look into it. All right, so let's put this here. And I have to remember that the hammer, the hammer is upstairs in the bathroom. Just in case I can go out the front door, it's, I need that hammer that's in the bathroom. 
All right, so let's see what all we have here. Okay, I have, I need the screwdriver too. Okay. Yeah, I have, I still need that number one. I'm going back down into the sewers. So I'm going to take my screwdriver. I've already opened up that other tunnel. And then I have to go up the elevator. So hopefully I'll find some really good stuff down there. Hello, Nellie, how are you? Thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Do you like my little, my little stash right here? Yes, I put all my... I put all my goodies right here. Hello, Shannon. Okay, Lucy, thank you for hearting me. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Oh, and then also too, if anybody has their phone in the landscape mode, if you just joined, you can actually watch in the portrait mode or you could go landscape you could watch it this way you can watch it that way because i am streaming on tiktok's um, live stream you can actually do that but they did an update to it today and i think if you're watching in the landscape mode now you can actually see the comments so i know some of you have mentioned before that you like to watch it in landscape but you can't see the comments and I think that it is, um, and I think that's okay. <laughs> you would have camped. I would have so many times. Oh, so, okay. Awesome. They did update. Awesome. So does that make it better for you? Because they are really, really working on making the adjustments to make this absolutely more like um like f game friendly katie i'm doing well oh awesome awesome i'm glad there is a button to show comments too great what i sent the link f oh, oh okay awesome okay thank you rosa i am i am on easy i have not graduated yet to normal but soon soon i am going to be um, playing this on normal uh let's see if i can see her Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. <sighs> I have, and uh, truthfully, I never got out of the cellar. It is so hard having to try to fight both of them. It was insane. And so I, like I said, I have played it. I'm just not a huge fan of that just because of the difficulty. Okay. Lucky, that's why I get mad. I'm like BS. I, I don't know, but I mean, if you saw grandpa, we wouldn't want him anyway. So I always just, you know, that's like my, that's my comfort. That's what I stick to. So everyone, um, ah, pretty me. Thank you so much. Number one, thank you, Lucky. You knew what I was going to ask. Oh, I don't care about this. Oh. All right. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Okay. Oh, you did? Oh, wow. So I definitely, oh, look, there's a piece of the shotgun right there. Awesome. Awesome for, oh, no, no, no. Okay, now I want to get out. Okay. 
All right, kids, now we're in business. All right, let's go get her. All right, I'm armed and dangerous. Now, I know I had the dart gun before, but I can get more things with this. Yes, yes, Charmed, I did figure that out finally. Um, um, but I just don't like the layout of the house, and I'm like totally freaked out over spiders. And that little spider baby just sends me over the edge. Just right over the edge. Right over the edge. Hello, Angel. User number 92558823562402. Thank you so much for the follow. Ebony, thank you for my heart puff. I appreciate you. Um, okay. Um, am I a reader? Amber, I do enjoy reading. I just, where am I going? I'm going the wrong damn spot. No, I kind of am, but I'm kind of not. Um, I enjoy reading. I just don't have much free time. And as sad as it sounds, it, I just don't have the luxury right at this moment to uh, be able to sit down and enjoy a book, but I do enjoy reading. Ah. I don't need that meat. Oh, let's see if I can get out of here before she comes in. Nope, there she is. Oh, she got me. Damn it. <sighs> EMT4, thank you so much for my high bear. Thank you. I appreciate that. I also too want to let anybody know that if you have not subscribed to my channel or if you were gifted a subscription, I do want to let you know that it is $2.99 a month. And the little button is either up there or down there if you would like to subscribe. If you don't, I love you very much anyway. And thank you for being a part of my life. I'm not the best salesperson and I don't really want to like make it sound like a sales pitch. But I do want to let you know that I did opt for the, uh, the least expensive subscription I could just to make it so a little bit more inclusive. So hopefully... Um, if you want to subscribe, that would be something you could do. That's what I'm saying. Well, thank you, Lucky. I appreciate that. Jessica, thank you for my team bracelet. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You know, I think a little kindness goes a long ways in this world. That's what I say. Well, thank you, Charmed. I appreciate that. I appreciate you. I was going to tell you all something else, and I can't remember what I was going to tell you. Ah, that's what happens when I have so many thoughts running through my head. So what I'm going to do... Okay, so now this spider up here, the one that I'm about to face is this one scares me the grandma spider in the um, downstairs um oh okay the grandma spider downstairs um does not scare me this one definitely does and the reason that this one scares me is because it is so freaking lifelike that i don't like it Looks like a big black widow. Okay, so let's go get my gun because she's going to be coming around here. And I want to do a couple of other things before we leave. So I'm sure she would have heard that. Ah, then, thank you for my heart. I appreciate that. And it says that that's your first gift on TikTok. And that makes, that makes it even, that makes it really cool. I appreciate you. Brenna, thank you for the follow. Um, oh, very cool. Thank you. <gasps> Elizabeth, thank you for my ducks on parade. 
I got a mama duck and a baby duck. I got ducks on parade. They go quackity quack quack and then they go quackity quack quack. And they walk here and they walk there. Ooh, okay. I need those two things. Ah! I have I have accidentally um I think I'm going to leave that for here for right now. But I have accidentally um, fallen down there. And that does not work out well for me. So I'm going to try to not do that. I got a mama duck and a baby duck. And I got ducks on parade. Okay, let's keep going. Um... Oh, very cool, Vin. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. I do appreciate that, and I appreciate each and every single thing that everybody does. Every heart, every tap, every comment, everything that you do helps, and I appreciate you immensely. Oh, wow. Okay. So here's, and the reason that I just said, oh, wow, okay, is because I can actually get out Lucky! Lucky just sent out some subscriptions. And um, if you just got one, you can thank Lucky Tay. She just sent out five gift subs. So you will be a subscriber for one month. And then after that, if you want to resubscribe, you can. Again, it's $2.99 a month. Thank you, honey. I appreciate that so much. United Earth, thank you for the follow. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <gasps> Tegan, you got one. Awesome. Yay. And then also, too, I do want everybody to know because I think that this is really super important. Okay. Where did I find that wooden stick? Remember that wooden stick that I was like, oh, it's downstairs. Okay. Because I can actually get out through Spider Town. I can get out through Spider Town and I've never gone that way. So let's see if I can't make it out that way. Oh. Jasmine, thank you for the follow. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. We have new baby beans. Ooh, I don't like this way. I don't like this. I, I'm saying I don't like this way, but it's, I've never been out this way, but let's see if I can't do it. <sighs> All right, everybody, let's see if we can do this. Let's see if we can do this. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Schmeek, schmeek, schmeek. Schmeek, schmeek, schmeek. Oh, you know what I can I need to do really quick? Um do, do. Okay. Okay, let's go. I played so I didn't have to be quiet. I found a lot of secret rooms. <gasps> Oh, so on this one. So for the game agenda today, we are playing this granny. And then I am going to be playing some Phasmophobia for a while. And then we are going to do a new Spot the Anomaly game called um, Death Watch, which looks really cool. And then uh, we are going to maybe be doing a an escape room thing. <sighs> All right, let's see if we can't get enough stuff down here. I've never, like I said, I've never gotten out this way before. So where is she at? Where is she at? Where's my friend at? She's right there. And then I'm going to go down this way. I'm going to look for her this way. Let's see if I can't get my way back. Ugh! Okay. Whew. All right. So now what I want to do is I could go the other way. Okay, let's go. Let's go get the stick. 
Let's go get the stick, everybody. Because then I need those chain cutters. Grandpa, thank you for the follow. <laughs> Tegan, that happens to me all the time. I'll be sitting here and I'll be fully engrossed in what we're doing. And Indy will bark at the Amazon guy. And I jump through my skin. So I totally get that. Okay, so let's go back and see if we can't escape through spider town mm -hmm. hello giggle snicker how are you <sighs> oh angel i agree too i love this um thank you sharon i appreciate that Resume. Okay, let's get going. Hello, Melissa. The ghost on Phasmo just appeared in front of me twice. I'm going to be joining you here shortly. And I... I don't know. You. Oh, shit. She got me. Gosh darn it. Excuse the language. I just did a... I just did a poop bomb. <sighs> Melissa, thank you for hearting me. And Izzy, thank you for my team bracelet. The bed hag got me. Yep, yep, yep. Ebony, good night going. You're going to fall asleep watching this and the fourth night in a row. Absolutely love that. I am the best white noise you could ever have. Um, yes, Nicole, we did. Ben, thank you for the roses. We did finished the fears to fathom yesterday and we're oh shoot okay I need these too I couldn't figure out how to get the items down from the high shelves do you know um you should be able I mean just make sure you're not crouching, but you should be able to get them. Um, if they're up above, you should be able just to like point your mouse up there and grab them. I would think I've never had any problems. Um, I've never had any problems trying to get those down from there before. So I'm sorry if I'm not, if I'm not helping very much. I cannot believe this. This is my last day, everybody. I just went from being super confident to being super like, oh no. She does have it out for me today. Oh no. So here's the thing is that it used to be that I would, you know, like, Oh, no. <laughs> uh, one more. We're going, we're going, right, Granny and I are going at it one more time. I am not going to let her get away with that. Yeah, in the car, everything. Yep. She does. I'm coming back with a vengeance, though, y'all. I am, Granny, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you, Granny. That's right. Damn it. Nobody messes with me and my beans. You would think so. This one's all jacked up on bed hag juice or something. <sighs> gotta breathe, Lania. Gotta breathe. <laughs> Beans assemble. We ride at dawn. Okay. Ah, uh, pet setting vibes. Thank you for my rose. I appreciate that. And Julie, thank you for hearting me so, so much. I appreciate each and every single one of you. 
and you are an amazing community and i love you and i'm just gonna sing all day long all right where are you where are you look sneaker sneakerson's down here going around got nothing in here this time okay i can hear her ah hurry lonnie hurry nope okay that just made me sweat for some reason okay so here's part of the shotgun Let's see if I can't. There's nothing in that bookshelf. I think one of the things that I really appreciate about this game so much is each and every time we play it, it's something completely different. And it's not like I have to sit here and like repeat the same thing on like over and over again. I mean, it's like each and every time we play this, we get an absolutely new experience. And I like that. I think that's really cool. So that's, like I said, that's one of the reasons why I like this game so much is that it's not repetitive. Because if that's one thing I don't like, that's re being repetitive. Um, that's what our bathroom looks like after hair wash day. Oh, I know. Um, Um, okay, who, okay, um, who's, yeah, Perota, who's, di who is that? I didn't get to see the beginning of it. Um, thank you for the follow. Um, you would think so. A bean riding a unicorn, of course. Um, oh, no. Oh, your mom, she turned, yes, I will wish her happy birthday. Happy birthday to Diamond. Um, I Congratulations for making it 10 years old. Happy birthday to you, to the little, your mom's fur baby. Happy birthday. I know Indy's almost, Indy's going to be two this year. Everybody can say happy birthday to, to Diamond. Okay. All right. We got a little controller here. Do, do. She's saying thank you. Is she wagging her tail? Like, is she just like, oh my gosh, I feel so special. The internet is wishing me a happy birthday. And then if anybody ever celebrates their pet's, pet's birthday with like birthday cakes or birthday parties, you have to put that on Discord. Um, this is called Granny and Vin. <gasps> Vin, you are my new baby bean. Vin, welcome to my bean family. We laugh, we cry, we support each other. Do you want to know why? It's because we are the bean family. All right, everybody send out the new bean emote to Vin. She just subscribed and we have a new baby bean. And do you want to know why? Oh, shoot. Because she's amazing. She just came out of nowhere. Lucky Tay, thank you for my baby duck. Thank you for my mama duck. Because we got ducks on parade. We have a mama duck and a baby duck. We have ducks on parade. And they go quackity quack quack. Quackity quack quack. Hello, Heather. Thank you, Vin, for subscribing. Your number, oh, it took away my counter. But thank you so much. <laughs> He's my little extra jump scares that you all aren't ready for. Yep, just when you think that there's nothing to be scared about. OK. 
Okay, we have a cog wheel. All right, we just don't know what number yet. <gasps> I know, except she was never really that tiny. I mean, she was a big puppy. I mean, when I got her, I was, when I got Indy, Indy was really, no, when I got Liberty, she was super young when I got her. She was only like that big. And when I got Indy, she was like gargantuan. She was like this big old fat puppy. Double dogs, thank you so much for the follow. It's just randomly like somewhere on the house. We'll be walk, running by or we'll open a drawer and we'll see either a number one or a number two. And then that's the number that I have to remember for when I go down into Spider Town. So I never know where it's going to show up. It just miraculously pops up. So it's, oh, see, like right there, number two. So that's the, oh, that's the number we're looking for. So that was actually perfect timing and trying to describe what I was looking for. So thank you very much, Granny's House, for providing that for us. Number two. Jade, thank you for my cheers. Thank you for my hearting me. And thank you for my team bracelet. I appreciate that. Um, Les, thank Liz Manal Devil. Lizminian Devil, thank you so much for the follow. And I'm sorry, I probably said that completely wrong. And thank you for my roses. And Heather, thank you for my heart. Um, let's see what we got here. Ooh, curry sounds good. Hello, Destiny. How are you doing today? How was your Tuesday? How was your Tuesday? Yep, I'm thinking this year's the year that the cat distribution system is going to just bring me a kitten. Or an old cat. It's just going to bring me a cat. But if it doesn't, I totally get it. And I'm fine with that too. Okay. So let's go. Let's go right here. Yeah, I think I truthfully, I think if I was going to ever adopt a cat, I would definitely adopt an older cat. <laughs> she has anger issues. Oh my gosh, one time when, the, uh, when my kids were little, I got this cat that I don't know what it had against Brandon, but oh my God, it would attack Brandon all the time. And I felt so bad for him. I'm like, oh my gosh, I'm the one that got this cat and it's attacking my child. So, huh? Yeah, it. yeah it, was, it was so bad. Uh, Robert even mentioned um, that we had to actually get rid of it. It was such an aggressive cat towards Brandon. And Brandon is like the biggest animal lover ever. <sighs> yeah, Claire, I think, um, truthfully, I think, uh, I think boy, I, I don't know. I've had both boy cats and girl cats. And my boy cat was definitely like, he wasn't quite the hunter that my, my girl cat was. I don't know where she is, but I'm running from her. Oh, okay. Okay, if we need that stick for to escape down where the spider is, just remind me it's in that closet. Okay, so let's see here. My boy cat is a literal magical princess. I love that. I have a kitty. Her name is uh, Freya. Made her a moat in my Discord. Ah. How cool. Um, I don't kill the spider. I, I, you don't kill either spider. You can trap one and you run from the other. Uh, I got a black hat last year, named him Magnus, and he gets mice all the time. Really? That's super cool. My cat was just lazy. My cat was just like, nah, I'm not going to do anything. <gasps> Sierra, thank you for my ducks on parade. 
I got a mama duck and a baby duck. I got ducks on parade. The mama duck goes quack, 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 and the baby duck goes quack, quack, quack. And they are ducks on parade. Thank you for my ducks on parade. Okay, so for this, she's up there. I know, I hear her. I hear her. She's doing some not so very kind stuff. So I'm going to put that right there. Let's come and look and see what's over here. Ooh. Okay, we need that. We need that. So let's go take care of this really quick. Andrea, thank you for my rose. Jessica, thank you for my rosa. And I need that. Okay. Um, Jade, you should join uh, the Discord, and I have a um, I have a spot right there for all of the uh, all of our pets. So just join the Discord and show, and I would love to see your kitty cat. So you ask, and you ask, and you shall receive. Oh, very cool, Lucky. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, there's all sorts of cool stuff there on Discord. I do. It's um, the my link tree. It's in my link tree that's in my bio. So all everything that you ever need to know about um, all the platforms is right there. I think I want to do this a little bit different. I want to get everything I need to do with the hammer done. <sighs> do, do, do. To be in a magazine? Yeah, if you want to post that in the general chat, I would. Um, if you are going, I mean, we have to support him to be to win a contest. Absolutely. I don't think that that would be a problem. I mean, it's my Discord, so I can say yes or no. So yes, absolutely. Go ahead and um, put that in there. I will gladly vote for him. Do do. Let's go ahead and do this. Okay, so now we've done everything we need to do with the hammer. And that's the first time I've done this this way. And I think I kind of like that. So that way, I know everything that's been done has been done. Hello, Chelsea. How are you? Do you play? Uh, do you play a different way each time? You know, I genuinely have like an idea of how I want to like go about looking for stuff, but truthfully how I play really depends on what I find. So for example, I found that hammer. So I purposely came over here. Um, I had to go unlock the door. I had to unhammer the boards on the door. And then I had the thing upstairs to do and then in the uh, basement. So really it depends on what I find is where I go next. Hello, Trina, how are you? Oh yeah, and that's just the thing about the game that I wish I could find more games like this is that each and every time I play this game, new I mean, it's it all moves around. I never know, I know where the hiding spots are, but I never know what's going to be there, so I never know like where I'm going to be going next, if that makes any sense. I'm doing good. Um, have you heard of Little Kitty Big City? No. But I think it might sound like something I'm going to have to look into. Elizabeth, have you heard of that one? Little Kitty Big City? I've seen Hello Neighbor, but I've never played that one. 
Um, Vin, thank you so much for my heart puff, my puff, and my team bracelet. And thank you again for the subscription. I really appreciate that. Thank you. It's hard, but super fun. That's okay. I, um, I do not mind a difficult game so long as it's a fun game. If that makes any sense. I don't mind challenging so long as I'm having fun while I'm doing it. <gasps> Damn it, she scared me. I was not expecting her there. She scared me on that one. No, um, no, I was just, I didn't know where she was at, so I was just trying to creep around, but now that I know that she was there, I think I'm going to try to go a different area, because she has not been playing very nicely, like, for example, she's been just respawning right where I'm at. <laughs> Adrian, I'm glad to know I'm not the only one that does that. Oh, I just saw it pop up. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Um, okay, Melissa. Yeah, yeah. No, the spiders are only, um, the only spider you ever see is the one downstairs. And um, I always give little content warnings before I go down into Spider Town. That's the only time. Do do. Yeah, no, I'm not doing any more super gory games. I mean, I like scary games. Uh, I'm just really going to try to stay away from anything that shows that's super graphic and super. Um, I don't need to see somebody's head getting ripped off. Let's just put it that way. Um, for example, like on this one, yes, she hits me over the head with a stick, but it's not super gory. Um, and so I'm okay with that. Or a spotted anomaly game where, you know, maybe we'll see like, I don't know, a ghost or a body part or something. I mean, that doesn't bother me either. And I'm always open for new games. I would definitely do a game maze. Um, I personally, and okay, so here's the thing, y'all. I'm always encouraging you all to stream. I'm always telling you it's an amazing thing to do. And my number one um, streaming tip is always stream what you play, stream what you like to play. If you're not enjoying the game, it's not, it's gonna be hard to stream. It's just, that's such a simple rule but such an important role, all right? So now, I really like scary games. I like to be scared. I like to be on the edge of my seat. I like to jump scare. I like those games. So it's really difficult for me to find a game that's super scary that doesn't have a lot of gore. So when I'm like, I'm not going to play gory games anymore, and then if I go to a game that's not like, exciting or interesting I just I can see the difference in my gameplay so it's just I don't know it's a double-edged sword with everything that um, we're trying to figure out like what I'm gonna play if that makes any sense so and I do appreciate every single one of your recommendations and I do oh, uh, I, I look into every single one of them No, I'm not going to enjoy anything with spiders, like massive spiders. Um, I have a fear of spiders, and I don't think I could relax enough to actually um, enjoy the game. Huh. Okay, so where's the book, everybody? Oh, there she is right there. Um, 
are you going to play the yes yes geo floors yes that's going to be that's most likely going to be tomorrow on our wild card wednesday um i i had a lot of fun with that one um <gasps> yes dj those are like that's like my little um that is my little go-to i do love a good um a good uncrustable with hazelnut yes absolutely so no scrutinized unfortunately is out um the content is something that is i don't i i'm I was playing it the other day, trying to get past day two. And the content of the reports that people were sending in involved harming animals, um, younger individuals, um, people being married, not being nice to each other. And I will not be a part of that. So that is, again, sadly, off of our off of our game playing i just yep nope i was super bummed too because i thought it had a lot of potential but the reports the more i played the cringier the reports were getting and i was like well damn it you know i can't do that which is a complete bummer but Again, the game developers don't ask me my opinion, so nothing I can do about it. She's right there. Oh my goodness, if I had stopped to look, she would have gotten me. It's the reports, yeah. You know, it's the reports that the neighbors were sending in. I've had that one too, DJ. Now, the honey and the peanut butter one Put those in the toaster, and those are absolutely just really good. Um, Farrell, I'm not too sure about either one of those, but I'll look into those. Hello, Veronica. Ammy, Am Hammy, thank you for my roses. I appreciate you. Yeah, no, the reports, like I said, the reports, the more I played, the cringier the reports were getting. And you know what, maybe that wouldn't bother some people. And maybe some people could be like, well, it's just, it's not real, it's fictional. But I unfortunately, I'm like, mm -mm, I don't like it. I don't want to see it. I don't want to hear about it. I don't want to, I don't want to play a video game about it. Thank you, Elizabeth. Yeah, yeah. Now, I really like, um, I really like the peanut butter and honey ones toasted. I can eat the other ones toasted or not, but the peanut butter and honey ones, I think, are <gasps> chef's kiss in the toaster. So the one thing I have not found, which is kind of, oh, okay, I know where we can go. Uh, I know where we can go. Meg, thank you for my roses. And Vin, thank you for my tiny diny. Thank you. Thank you so much. So yeah, I know it's raining outside. It's up, 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 run, run, run. Hide, hide, hide. It's cold, it's rainy, it's all dark outside. We're playing spooky games and it's awesome. <sighs> um, Amy, I like to read, unfortunately. I just don't have a whole lot of time. Um, I just don't have a whole lot of time to do it, so. It's a matter of me just being able to um, kind of sink in, to drop in and enjoy it. And right now, I just, again, unfortunately, I don't have that time. Is that open yet? No. Okay, so now what we have to do... Oh, shit. Oh, oh, gosh darn it. She got me. I knew that was her. I thought it was the mannequin at first. And then I'm like, no, it's just, I thought it was her. Then I'm like, no, it was the mannequin. And it was her. Yeah, exactly, Amy. Sunny, thank you for the follow. 
I am a busy bean. And if you were asking what um, video game that I was talking about where the content got cringy, it was scrutinized. Um, it was a really cool game. It was a really good game idea that, oh, there's the book, that I personally think that they made um, too cringy. So that's, I don't know where she's at, but she's after me. <sighs> Lonnie, I'm sending you the plushie. Okay, cool. Oh, cool. Thank you. Lucky, I appreciate that so much. Um, that game was weird, but we have hope to find better games to play. Exactly. You know, and that's just the whole thing. Um, that's just the whole thing. That's like if one, if one doesn't work for us, there's hundreds more that will. Okay, so what this book does is, Julie, how are you? I'll show you what this does. So this book, we have to take over here. And that releases that, that ends up being the spider that's down in the attic. Which I've heard conflicting reports. One, somebody told me it was her sister and somebody else told me it was her mom. Cloudy, thank you for sharing my live. Emmy, thank you, yes, tap, tap, tap. Tap, 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 tap. So you can start with like 50 or, yeah, something like that. Yeah, I like that idea. Tap, 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 mm -mm. tap, tap, tap. Elena, thank you for sharing my live. Tap, tap, tap. Meg, thank you for my roses. I appreciate you. All right, let's go. We have to go back up. Elizabeth just sent me a duck on parade. We have a mama duck. We have a baby duck. We have ducks on parade. They go quackity quack quack and the baby goes quackity quack quack because they're ducks on parade. Ooh, ah! <laughs> Did you like my little scream? Uh, oh, Lana. Oh, okay. Thank you. I try my best to pronunciate everybody's user's name correctly. And if I ever mispronounce, if I ever mispronounce it, um, just send me the correct way to pronounce it. And I will do my best to do that um, to correct it. So... And I don't, you know, truthfully, I don't think it's rude at all if you correct me for how you pronounce your name. I'm telling people that they're spelling my name wrong all the time. So, nope. You just let me know. Oh, I'm trying to run. <sighs> Hello, Leaf. Lonnie, if, if, if we ever misspell your name, it's because your um, device, because our devices are incorrect. Yes, and you know what? And truthfully, that does not bother me on here. It's more like um, if I'm getting an email from somebody who's all like, oh, we would love to collaborate with you, and they spell my name wrong. And I'm like, uh, you might want to spell my name correctly before I'm going to collaborate with you, but that's just, you know, that's just my way of thinking. So, nope, if, if you ever there's an E or a one in or anything like that on here, it does not bother me. I'm talking more like in a professional setting. That's when it gets to me. Um, yes, absolutely. And you have to remember, and I love you all dearly, and I really do do my best to remember and to pronounce, but there's one of me and there are three thousands of usernames to remember so again if i ever don't say it correctly please don't think that i'm 
it's because I don't care. It's just because there's a lot. So I do try. I do try. I do try. Amanda, thank you. Um, oh, all the time. It always adds an E to the end of my name. Haley, thank you so much for the follow. Okay, so what we're going to do. Uh, go, go, go. Go, go, go. Go. Oh, shit. Oh, go, go, go. Red, red, run. Ah! Whew. I thought she was going to run past. Uh, I thought she was going to run across the board. I did not realize she had to go through the little room. Yep. Nope. Did not know. Oh, Daria. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Daria. Happy birthday to you. Okay. So, I got that. That's to get out of Spider Central. Hello, Rock. How are you? Uh... Hello, Coco. Oh, cool. Okay. Cool, Lucky. Thank you again. Haley, thank you for sharing my life. Sierra Bonds, thank you for hearting me. I appreciate you so much. Okay, so now what we have to do is I have to get back upstairs, but she seems to always know where I am these days. So let's see. Okay, so, okay, I have the stick. Let's see if I can't run and get this really quick. Okay. All right, all right, all right. There she is. Let's have her chase me down this way. Tori, thank you for sharing my live. Coco, I'm going to be doing Granny, and then from here we're going to do Phasmophobia, and then we're going to do some, it's called Death Watch, and it's a really cool Spot the Anomaly game, and then um, we might do some Escape Room. It really depends on how much we like the, first, the third game, but the Escape Room is on, ooh, the Weapon Key. The escape room is on the docket. Yeah. Kat says, hopefully you will still be on in an hour. Would love to watch you play Phasmophobia. I'll be back. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, I'll be on. I'll be playing um, this for probably um, another 30 minutes or so. And then I'll be playing Phasmophobia for a couple hours. So I'll be back. I'll be doing it. I'll be doing it. Ah. Okay. Let's see if we can't go get the dart. Oh, did you see she came running around that way? So she was right there. So let's go over here. Let's get armed up, everybody, because we're going to go do some granny hunting. Ah. No, I've never played Gone Home before. Do, do. Janie, how are you? Pandora, I'm doing well today. How are you doing? Ha <laughs> ha! Take that, you bed hag. Oh my god, look how dramatic. Ooh, she shot me.
Okay. Oh, we got gasoline also. I'm thinking I'm going to take a break. Hopefully, I'll remember to come back later. Well, hopefully you do. Uh, oh, it won some awards. Okay. I'll definitely check that. You had a rough day where people just being rude. Okay, so interesting, interesting, interesting stuff that we have now. Oh, you're very welcome. Thank you for the subscription. Mm -hmm. Oops. So let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got here. All right. So let's go and see here and here and here and here. So the master key will get me out to the front door. I've already undone the lock. I just need the padlock key to get out the front door. Shut the front door. Okay, I think we have more of an opportunity to get out either through the front door or Spider Town. Yes, how are you? Uh, yes, the supervisor are too much drama sometimes, and it makes me and it makes work harder. I'm, ugh. you know what, supervisors. Okay, if you're a supervisor out there, I'm going to tell you right now because I've had my fair share of supervisors who are so insecure that the only thing that they can do is try to make um, people's lives miserable. Please don't do that. You know, you don't have to be mean to be authoritative. You can be just, you can have just as much authority and be nice. So that's what I don't get. Um, probably in about 30 minutes or so. Oh, really? Oh, Iris, that's a, that's a good accident. Um, ooh, Claire, that's awesome. Is he going, gro is he going gross hunting? But yeah, that's, I absolutely, it just drives me crazy. All right, if anybody has a fear of ginormous grandma spiders or small spaces, please watch with caution. Charlotte, good night, honey. Um, you have, you'll need to come and speak to my managers then. They're all negative Nancys. I would love to. You have no idea. That would be like if I was ever going to go back to work, work. You know, this is work. But I would want to be like somebody who professionally went in and got to hold up for the employee. I would excel at that. Just so it could show me its, um, so it could show me its ugliness. So I'm gonna put that there. I want to put. I need that. Yes, I would so do that. Uh. Pick it up, Lonnie. Pick it up and run. Okay. Brittany, thank you so much for the follow. Okay, so there's a spark plug. I don't really need a spark plug. I saw her. I could use that though. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. I got it. I got my ducks on parade. I got a mama duck and a baby duck. I got ducks on parade. 
I had a giant spider trying to eat my face, but I saw the ducks and they're on parade. Thank you, Lucky, for my ducks on parade. Kelly, thank you for my ducks on parade. I got a mama duck and a baby duck and I got ducks on parade. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Lucky, sorry, I, I caught you out of the corner of my eye, but I was like, trying to eat me okay so miss page that's probably been probably i would say without a doubt the hardest part of this game to figure out um, um i'm gone it's my first time in the live and i'm living already awesome i love it welcome welcome i love having you here we are i'm here nightly and my community is called the beans and we are an amazing community hi sally um uh oh very cool janice hello sky how are you yes maritza thank you so much so and um kelly thank you for my duck on parade also so anyway, this has been the hardest thing for me to figure out where to go without a doubt, but I have, um, I, I play it so much. I've kind of gotten a little bit better at figuring out where things are. Amy Lou, thank you for my rose and Emma Peel. Thank you for my roses. Emma, thank you for hearting me and Trina. Thank you for my duck zone parade. I got a mama duck and a baby duck and I got ducks on parade we actually had a tornado warning here um in the next county over this afternoon which is crazy we do not have tornadoes in california rosa marie thank you for my heart puff but we don't have tornadoes in california we have earthquakes and i don't know why we had a tornado warning yes nope she goes all over the place Oh, yeah. Sally, are you in Northern or Southern? Lucky, thank you for my game controller. I appreciate you so, so much. If I remember correctly, she went this way. Yes, she did. Southern, yeah. So that's where I'm at. I'm in Southern California also. Lucky, thank you for my good games. No, I didn't... Um, Fortunately, where I'm at in Southern California, I live actually on a little bit of a hill. So I don't, I don't worry about flooding. I worry more about the wind and the tree damage than I do actual floods. And, uh, but that doesn't say, but that doesn't mean that Temecula hasn't flooded. Because I remember back in 1993, I was pregnant with Brandon and Temecula flooded so bad, people had to get canoes to get out of their um, businesses. So we have had crazy weather like that. We just, we, we seem to do better these years, these days. Oh, you're a 1993 baby also? Awesome. Betsy, Betsy's in the house. She's all like, you push that button, you tap that screen. So, yep, nope, Robert was 1990, Brandon was 1993. My kids are two and a half years apart. Oh, you're 1993 also? Oh, very cool. Oh, shit. Oh, I thought she was going to bonk me on the head. That made me sweat, everybody. All right, hydration time. She just made me sweat. You're closer to the coastline than I am. Oh, okay. 1994, that's awesome. <laughs> You're our Robert. Ninety one, baby, that's awesome. You were basically pregnant for two years. Wow. 1990 there oh very cool leaf oh okay that's i was i was i didn't know what to think i thought maybe you were going to insult my um 
my phasmophobia equipment when I play later. You just never know. You're 75? Ah, 89. How cool. Yeah, Betsy's in the house. Y'all are going to have to start tapping that phone. I'm a 1964 baby. Oh, shoot. I wonder if I can get past this. Nope, that's a big answer for that. Let's go get me a shotgun, and then I can get a couple of different things. Let's see if I can't get out of here. Hello, beans. Oh, your mom was 1964? It was a good year, man, I tell you. It's crazy how, I don't know, I think the 70s were quite the, because I was born in 64, but I just remember like the 70s, 60s and the 70s. Um, parenting was kind of just an option. I remember the shit, all the trouble I got in, and I was, I'm constantly like, where were my parents? And I just think it's a crack. I, I cracked myself up. I was such a mischievous child. <laughs> what kind of clothes style were you in the 80s? Um, I very much had like, kind of like the Madonna style, I would say, where I would have like the brooch right there with the high collar. Um, I worked in a bank in La Jolla, actually. And um, I very much had the working girl vibe where I would go to work with my tennis shoes and then I would put my, I would put them on um, and, you know, walk for lunch. And I was very much, that was my vibe. And I also, um, I also liked, um, I really liked the stray cats. So I got all into the whole, like, what was that called? It kind of like, <sighs> it was, what was that called? Nope, never, never. I wasn't, I was more new wave. Um, it was kind of like the, the rockabilly. Yes, rock mixer. I loved rockabilly. Ah, uh, Miss Paige, thank you for my ducks on parade. I got a mama duck and a baby duck. I got ducks on parade. There she is. Um, I had the penny loafers with a penny in them, and I had my pink polo shirts. Um, I, yeah, I really like the rockabilly. I have to re refine my vibe. Having kids as marriage made me forget who I am, so I have to refine it. Sally, I personally don't think we ever lose it. I think we ignore it if that makes any sense. Your vibe has never gone away. You've just put it on a shelf. And so um, it was, I think once you start looking inward, you're gonna find you and you're gonna know exactly what kind of vibe you want. That's, that's, that's the way I look at it. Yeah, because for me, um, it, it's weird. I'll, I'll get dressed, and it's like kind of the same aesthetic that I had in the 80s. I still wear today or in the 90s. So I never, it, I just don't think we lose it. I just think we just choose, uh, not choose, but I think, I think we, it gets, it gets um, buried in the whole kind of things of life. Yeah. Yeah. Elizabeth says, I feel like society tells us to us to cool it once we get to a certain age and then we have a family. Yeah. yeah. Are you kidding? Once you turn 50, society looks at you and tells you just to kind of sit there, sit down, shut up and fade away. And I'm all like, oh, nobody puts baby in a corner. Uh, nobody is telling me to fade away. And so that is basically my whole platform is to fight that, to fight that stigma. And I will fight it until I can't, until I am no longer with us. Yeah, Lucky, 
Yeah, and you know what? And truthfully, nobody can make us fade away but us. I mean, yes, if you're in a if you're in a really bad relationship and you have somebody who is like a complete um, narcissist and and they've worn you down, I did not think I was going to get her. That's one thing. But if we listen to society and we let them and we kind of let it it get to us, um, then that's on us. We need to not do that. So I think I'm going to go. Style doesn't age. The thing is, is that, okay, we have an inside us and we have an outside us. And my inside me doesn't age. I still have the same energy. I have the still, I get myself into the same amount of trouble that I did when I was in my 20s. Um, society is a huge narcissist. You know, society is mean. They don't want us to excel, and they're just jerks. But it's up to us, whoa, whether or not we listen. Yeah. I mean, my, my soul is going to be, my energy is going to be my energy until the day I die. And it's not going, my energy doesn't say like, um, you can't do this or you can't do that. My energy is just my energy. <sighs> yeah. And that's just the whole thing is, is that we shouldn't have to act a certain way just because of the number that's on our driver's license. And again, I'm going to say this again and again and again and again and again. Everything that I do, I do to try to, um, to, try up, to try to just shake up the norms of society. Because I'm telling you right now, the majority of time when I go to places and I'm walking in or I... Uh, in a meeting or on a Zoom class with somebody, I don't look like anybody else but me. And I mean that in a way of like, Ooh, did you see me sneak right by her? I, I shouldn't be doing what I'm doing, but it doesn't stop me. Yeah, we love you exactly how, yeah. Oh, is lobster, uh, is Angel going? Um, um, oh, okay. I'm done caring about society. I'm going to do whatever makes me happy. Yes. Um, yeah, because you know what? You're never going to please everybody. There's always going to be somebody out there who's going to tell you you're doing it wrong. Janie, thank you for my ducks on parade. I got a mama duck and a baby duck, and I got ducks on parade. Thank you so much, Janie, for my ducks on parade. And Kai, thank you for my, my heart puffs. But yeah, that's just the whole thing is society. Well, you know what? Society is going to tell you what you're supposed to do, and they don't really care if it's your benefit or not they're just going to tell you what to do just to make you feel bad about yourself uh, lucky um i personally was i you know me i've been well um i was an alcoholic and an um just a plain old addict for the majority of my life and it wasn't until i got sober that i'm able to um, even start living my life. So I could look at it in two different ways. I could be like, oh man, I really effed up and I lost so many years of my life and how I should have done this and I should have done that. And that in itself would keep me just as, um, keep me just as down as my addiction did. Or I can say, you know what? It's part of who I am. I went that went through that for a reason, 
but nothing is ever going to put me back in that box again. And that's the way I look at it. You know, nobody's ever putting. Oh, did I get the wrong key? I got the wrong key, damn it. Nobody's ever putting me in that box. How many times can I run up this damn door? All right, we did it. Megan says, I'm, I'm trying to begin my sober journey. I just don't know how to start. Um, I did, oh, you know what I did? I, 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 Googled, I Googled how to be happy. And I just decided to just start one day at a time. Um, but I would definitely say, you know, reach out, go to AA meetings, talk to, talk to people. Do whatever you have to do to find that journey. Uh, Tia, thank you for my rose. And Elizabeth, thank you for my marvelous confetti. Um, you did rehab three times. Yep. Yeah. You have no idea how many times, um, how many times I tried to get sober before it stuck. Llama Cat, I'm glad that you're doing well, and I'm glad that you, you checked in. Thank you so much. Janie, thank you for my cheers. I appreciate that. Are you ready for some phasmophobia? Because we are phasmatics. We are fabulous. And we're going to play phasmophobia. VC, thank you for sharing my live. Exactly, Lucky. It's, it's, and you know what? And instead of stop trying, it doesn't matter if it takes you a hundred times or 50 times, you just have to keep trying. Um, do, do, do. <sighs> Thank you, Elizabeth. All right, I am going to, no, Veronica, I'm still stuck. I don't know if I'm ever gonna get past that spot, but I'm still trying. Uh, Iris, I completely agree. It, it took me years. It took me just years, but at least I didn't stop. All right, I'm going to run go use the restroom. I am going to, what am I going to get? What, ooh, maybe I'll just, I'm just going to go use the restroom. And then I will be right back. Mama Bear, thank you for the follow. And we're going to do some phasmophobia. So everybody grab something to eat, grab some snacks, get some water. Um, I will be right back.
Let's do this, everyone. All right, let's do this. Ducks on parade. <gasps> Janie, thank you for my cheers. And Elizabeth, thank you for my ducks on parade. Did I not hear those? We got more ducks? He was gone. I should have still. Uh, Elizabeth, thank you for my ducks on parade. I got mama duck and a baby duck. We got ducks on parade. The mama goes quack and the baby goes quack. And they got ducks on parade. I got surprise ducks. I love that. Thank you so much. Ah, Elizabeth, we got ducks on parade. We got a mama duck and a baby duck. We got ducks on parade. It goes mama duck goes quack and the baby duck goes quack. You can still hear me drink. Uh, I'll have to start muting it. Lucky, thank you for my ducks on parade. We got a mama duck and a baby duck. We got ducks on parade. Goal achieved. All right, you ready? Goal achieved. Yay. Oh, Indy would like to celebrate the goal. She's like, thank you, everybody, for the Ducks on Parade. My mom loves Ducks on Parade. My mom loves Ducks on Parade. Yes, she does. Okay, see what happens? No. Nope. All right. Let's do this, let's do this, let's do this. All right. I'm going to be serious. I'm a serious ghost hunter. <laughs> Lucky, thank you for my, my TikTok money gun. It was like... Da, 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 da. All right. Indy would like everybody to have a hydration station, please. Spike, I'm doing good. How are you? Ah, Lucky, thank you for my game controller. Brandy would like to send out another re daily reminder. Take your meds, drink your water, and love yourself. All right, let's do this. I'm ready to get me some ghosts. <laughs> Veronica, you know what? She's a good bee. Indy does her, she really does try very hard to um, be, you know, to just be a good bee. I still don't have much money. So let's go ahead. Lucky, thank you again. Danny, how are you? Um, and you dreamt in case ghost hunting. I love that. All right, let's go. Let's get this. Let's get this ghost. Ah. Janie, thank you for sending out five subs. All right, everybody. Janie just sent out five gift subs. So you can check your account. And if you have a little bar next to your name, you got a gift sub good for one month. And then after that, if you would like to resubscribe, it is $2.99 a month. And thank you very much, Janie. I appreciate that. We are up to 1,147 subscribers. Okay, so let's see who we're going for. Alex Martinez. Uh, repel the ghost with incense while it's chasing somebody. Since the only person it's going to be chasing is me. Prevent the ghost from hunting with a crucifix and get the ghost to blow out a firelight. All right, let's do this. What's tonight's snack? I made homemade brownies, and on the way back from the bathroom, I just grabbed a big old bite of one. So that. So that's what we got. And 
Let's get going in. So I am ready. I'm just, I, I'm jacked up on, on brownie and we are going to, we're going to make these ghosts just wish. I don't know. A ghost is probably going to kick my ass, but I'm going to try to, I'm going to try to find it tonight. You see, Danny, I don't like nuts in my brownies or my cookies. I think brownies and raisins have their own spot in their own thing and they don't belong in cookies or brownies. I'm sorry. Ooh, seasoned french fries, I do think that sounds good. I got a fancy flashlight. Oh, what's that? Oh, and no place to hide. <laughs> Their own spot is in the trash can. Kind of happy. Okay, raisins, I think, are nothing more than grapes gone bad. Um, a walnut, I can eat a walnut on its own if it's on the top of some brie cheese and honey. Oh. Okay, we have some something going on here. Okay, let's see what we got going on here. Not a five, but we definitely have a reading. Okay. Hello, Caitlin. Okay, let's see if we can't get a reading real quick. Is the temperature going to go down for us? <sighs> Goat cheese is good. Yeah, I love like baked brie cheese um, drizzled with honey and walnuts. That's so good. <sighs> and we have that. So I hope you all know how much I talk to TikTok about you all. Be okay. We just okay. What the hell is this? What was that? <sighs> that was a very long event though that was crazy because I'm trying to figure out if it's over here because we've got stuff thrown all over here I don't know, it reminds me of like one of those real old toys from the 70s where you'd have to blow on it and then you would like push the little buttons. Um, it looks like our temperature is going down. I think it's this room too. Yeah, we're down to... Okay, we're down to zero. And no more EMF, but let's go ahead and get our stuff. That's what I'm thinking. Hello, Addy, how are you? So let's go ahead. I'm going to go straight for the extra credit because mama don't got no money. And let's get a book. Um, what was I going to say? Look at that's crazy. Man, it went cuckoos. I have one of those, um, those little box things that I can talk through, but I have it set to a different To a different setting so it just it's more I don't have to actually speak in order to talk to it let's get going 
Yes, it's it's a very cozy winter night. Um, ghost hunting. It was a cozy winter night. Ghost hunting. Ah, oh, crap! I don't. I couldn't afford a candle. Okay. Excuse my my outburst there, but I couldn't afford a candle. <laughs> Connor was, he's quite something else, that's for sure. <sighs> okay, and hello, and how are you again? See anything? This thing is just singing. Do we have ghost writing? Okay, we have ghost writing. So, living room ghost, yep. So, we have ghost writing. I'm going to circle po poltergeist because I just have a feeling. Mm -mm -mm. And let's go in. Bubbles, thank you, Laura, for my roses. Thank you, honey. I appreciate that. Okay, we have orbs. Did you see the orbs, everybody? What? He just threw my... What in the hell did he put my dots? The jerk took my dots. He took my dots. No, that's the remote. No, no, no. That's the cross, that's the remote. Oh, there it is. Okay. I was very upset. Okay. So we had orbs on the... <sighs> okay. Let's go back and take a look here. So let's go ahead and put orbs. And, okay, I'll look at it again. <laughs> Thank you, Leaf. You think it's irreverent? Because I have, this is going to be between, a reverent will be freezing temps, a mare will be, a mare will be um, a spirit box, and then this guy right here ah 
Sierra Bond, just subscribe. Sierra, thank you for my subscription. My ghost just threw my camera, and I gotta go see what's going on. Thank you for being part of my bean family. Sierra Bond, thank you dearly from me. Thank you, honey. I appreciate that. Welcome, new baby bean. Uh, okay. It scares me. So let's see here. So let's see. Strength upon entering location, they will be active, defensive, and agile. They will weaken over time, making them weaker and slower. So let's see what. Uh, so let's see. Doesn't look like it's weakening very much. And then a mare. A mare will have increased a chance of uh, attack in the dark, turning the lights on around. A mare will lower its chance. Okay. And then a reverend is... A, a reverend is a violent ghost that will attack indiscriminately. Their speed can be deceiving as they are slow while dormant. However, as soon as they hunt, they can uh, move incredibly fast. It will travel at significantly faster speed when hunting. So I'll try. What do you think? I'm going to circle one. Which one would you suggest I circle? He was violently DJing. Exactly. A mare? Okay. Okay. Let's go back in. All right, kids, let's do this. Do I, ha I have one more hand. I'll go back with another thermometer just in case. Okay, so let's go ahead and throw that. Let's check the thermometer. It is not, so we're going to toss that. We have this. What oh, got me? I couldn't shut the door fast enough. Heather, thank you for my ice cream cone and my heart pops. I'm going to be down to like one piece of paper and a pencil. Welcome back. I've got some jobs ready for you. I got made $130. All right, let's try this again, kids. So, yeah, thank you for my lightning bolt. Thank you. Oh, so much. This is called phasmophobia. Yeah. For some reason, I, I don't know. I don't know what happened, but they're, like, tired of me cashing in on my insurance. So I don't start with very much stuff. Yes, I can't wait either. So my extra credit is I, I have to remember a candle at least. Um, I can try to prevent it. Oh, good, Marsha. Great. We all know how I, how I don't care for Marsha. Exotic, thank you so much for my crane. I appreciate you oh so much. Mm -mm. Do -do. Okay. All right, let's go. Let's go get this ghost. I have to I have to get back on a winning streak. 
It is just not, it's, it's not doing good for my self-esteem. Exotic, thank you for my hand heart. I appreciate that. I appreciate you. I really do. I hope you know how much I do. <sighs> Let's see if I can. At what level do I get a better dot? Because I think, aren't I like a level 20? I think that sounds like that's pretty high up. But I wouldn't have enough money to buy it. Twenty-nine, okay. I got a lot of ghosts to catch to upgrade my equipment. I got the lots of ghost hunting to do, everybody. So I'm going to just open the door a little bit because if I open it too much, I can't grab it. Okay, so I'm looking around, looking around. I think I need to start being faster and looking for like haunted items. So at least I can get pictures of that real quick. You know, I'm sorry, but corporate America is making me be like, I'm only thinking about the dollar during my ghost hunts right now. So I'm just saying, y'all, I would have a much more organic approach to ghost hunting if I wasn't worried about paying rent and buying equipment. <laughs> yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, the light's on. I did not turn the light on. Okay, so we have a jawbone. I have to go grab that. So let's go. Do we have anything down here? Do we have anything down here? No, we do not. Oh, look at rain boots. Um, okay, so we did get a hit on the EMF up here. So let me put this here. So now for this fancy EMF reader, do I have to like actually point it at the ghost to get a five? Thank you, Beans. What? Hello? Hello? Where's that phone coming? Oh. Let's see, let's see. Okay. So the phone rang in here. Let's put the thermometer right here. Let me go get some more stuff. The ghost is calling exactly. The ghost of unwashed clothes. I tell you what, that ghost could probably live in my house then. I always seem to have laundry to do, everybody. See, Iris, this is a full service stream. I even, we even remind you to finish your laundry. I love it. Okay, so let's take a picture of that. I'm gonna grab that. So let's put this here. Let's check the thermometer. Let's go ahead and put this here. Oops. Put that there. Just gonna put that there for now. I don't know where we're getting the EMF from. Okay, so it's a little colder in here. Okay. 
Yeah, that's what I was. No, the temperature's actually going up in here. Nope, temperature's going up on that side of the garage. And then over here, still going up. Kitchen? Okay. Don't have anything solid on this. Nope, it's going up in here also. And oh, that one, that one, um, that's the one that we played on Saturday that I quit. Um, where the spiders were scaring me and that's the one that we quit for content. Yeah, it's nothing great, but it's better. So let's go ahead and let me just drop this here and go grab some more stuff. I am gonna put this in here just in case for now. And then let's go grab some more stuff. Yes, that one. Okay, thank you, Leaf. Okay, so let's go ahead and grab. Um, we can talk to them. It will, yeah, because if the gun, tr if the ghost tries to hunt me, um, the cross will stop at one time, and then it burns up the cross. Okay, the lights are off. Oh. Okay, we have we have ultraviolet. And let's see what we got now. It's going down, but we still don't have freezing. Go ahead and go grab some more stuff. Running very slowly. Lonnie, I was just reading more about the game we played last night, and you'll never believe it. Which one? Um, the Fears to Fathom? Which one? Oh, the Firewatch? Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. Yeah, fears to fathom. Okay. Um. Okay. in I was in our TV bathroom after the restaurant <gasps> was in the RV oh oh okay we have orbs that's crazy That was sneaky. Yeah, remember? Because you saw somebody, but I did not realize that he snuck out of the RV. That's cool. Thank you for, for letting me know that. Yeah. Finn, thank you for my fire and my finger heart. Thank you so much.
Yeah, no, that, I think that's really awesome. So the guy that was fixing, that said he was fixing the um, radio tower was actually hiding in the RV bathroom. There's the orbs. Nope, that was me. Okay, so. <sighs> I don't have much to work with. So let's see, a banshee will need, a banshee will need the dots, orbs, and ultraviolet. Okay, um, a hound two will need freezing temps. And then an obake will need EMF five. Hello, Ansley. Okay, so I guess the only thing I can do is go back in. My sanity's still pretty good. All right, which one do you want me to circle before I go back in? I was, the spirit box is already in there. I was going to try that one again. A banshee? Okay. All right, let's go back in and see what we can do. I mean, I don't have a whole lot to work with, but we can at least try, right? Okay. Do you like how politely I shut the door? Okay. Okay, it gave us a little bit bigger spot for us to look. I can't, I don't have it, I lost it in the, I had to pawn my microphone. Remember, I, I'm, I'm ghost hunting on a budget. I can't afford it right now. I mean, the dots aren't bad. We should be able to see it go through. I am. Yeah. I'm like, I don't know, man. It's like, I, I feel like I drive up in this really fancy empty van and I tell people I'm going to be a ghost hunter and they're like, well, where's your equipment? I'm like, it's in my pocket. I have a toothpick and a piece of dental floss. Let's see what we got. It's quite active right now, but I don't see anything in here. <laughs> you can always tell them you're medium. Exactly, exactly.
It is the hoodie and the denim jacket. I went back to my uniform today. I wanted to be really, I wanted to be comfortable. <laughs> Tim, you ghost hunting, exactly. I don't know, y'all. I don't see dots. And if it's not dots... Tina, Tina's here. Is Tina here? <gasps> Tina, how are you, honey? How are you feeling? It's always a good day when I see Tina. Seventy-six. Janie, yay! Thank you. Hello, Sharon. Okay, Janie wants to know what your favorite merch is. She's going to buy some merch. And so what is some of your favorite merchandise that's in the shop? Okay, they just opened the door. Gavin, thank you for my heart. Thank you for my bracelet. And thank you for cheering to me. I'm getting better every day. Thank you. Miss you. Miss you too, honey. The beanie for sure. I love the beanie. I mean, personally, my favorites go from the beanie, the hoodie, the water bottle, um, and then pretty much everything. I love the, the joggers. I am going to be, um, I'm going to be making a bunch more stuff. So, yep, Betsy, it's in my link tree, and I also put it in the Discord under merchandise. Yeah, I had a lot of fun making that water bottle. It is, Tina. I, I launched the store yesterday. Yep. Okay. So, all right. I think, uh, so a band she was, was the dots, but I just don't have the dots. So, I had to... It's freezing temperature, but it's not freezing. I know Bake was the EMF, so I'm gonna circle. I'm gonna circle. What do you think? Hello, Nick the Chick. How are you, hun? That's the one I'm thinking too. Um. Hey, Lenny, I'm going to play. Oh, very cool, Dodge. I mean, it was a great game. It's very, it was very scary. I just, um, I have to be very respectful in my community and myself personally, and there was a, some content towards the end, but let me know how it ends. Yeah. Okay. So an Abaki is the EMF. So let's go back in with the EMF. Tina, thank you so much for my rose and my puss. All right, let's go back in. Let's try the EMF again. Yeah, please do. Let me know if she makes it out or if Snake Uncle gets her. Please let me know what the ending is like. Okay, so. Oh, we have under freezing temperatures. It's under freezing. Did you see that? The snuckle. Okay. Yep, it's definitely under freezing.
I'm just going to get my ass out of there. Yep. <laughs> I was like, I'm done. I have enough evidence. Yep. Yep. Uh, yep, yep, yep. I'm like, done. All right. <laughs> Lucky you're like, I know it is. If it's something else, if I'm wrong, I'm gifting a sub. I love that. I ran my little feetsies off. All right, so let's see what we got. We got the hand too. I got that one circled. I got a little bit more evidence. Remind me to buy a candle and let's get out of here. Um, she was in earlier. She said she was coming back later. Yeah, like... Like that kind of bean. Okay, okay, okay. I like this. We have a little bit more money. Okay, I feel like okay. I feel like I can buy a couple, a little bit more equipment. Okay, I have six hundred and sixty. I'm not going to go crazy, but I am going to buy. I'm going to put a candle in. So I am going to put that. No, I don't want to sell it. Why? Oh, wait, wait, wait. This is what I want to do. Okay. So I have the igniter incense. Do I have a candle? Get some salt. Okay. So I have salt, I have the photo camera. Um, okay, I have one candle, I have a crucifix. Okay, I think I'm good with this. I have, I have that already in there, I do have that in there. So I have that, I have my matches, I have my, ca uh, my, my camera. I don't want to go too, too crazy um, because that is what I need. Okay. All right, you ready? Well, yeah, I need the candle. All right, so let's go ahead. Um, until I just get a little bit more money, we're going to do this house again. Um, no, I only have one light. I have one light and I have one dots. So I have a dots and I have a light. Uh, the dots projector, the ghost rider, the thermometer. Yep. Okay. Let's go. Let's get let's get another ghost, everybody. Let's ready up and let's ride into the Tanglewood Drive. Woo! Oh, thank you, Betsy. I'm glad you like it. All right, we're here. Richie, I always appreciate seeing your face, honey. I appreciate you. Oh, you know what? I'm starting to get more of my stuff back. Like I got my salt. I got my candles. I need another cross, but I'm getting some of my stuff back. So with time, everybody, with time. All right. Let's go. Oh, Marsha. Marsha Sweeney. All right. I still don't have that. Capture a photo of the ghost. Cleanse the area. Uh, using incense. I can do that, everybody. All right, so let's go get her again. Another Marsha. Exactly. Marsha, Marsha, Marsha. <gasps> Christy Jean, how are you? <laughs> I know. I'm sorry, Leaf. You know what? You're like, I miss one day and Lonnie just falls apart and I'm like yes you are correct 
I'm doing good. I am ghost hunting. All right, I need to, oh, here we go, right away. Oh, we have this on. Not a five, but we have something. Okay. A little bit left over in the bathroom, but not bad. Let's go ahead really quick and just check the thermometer here. See what we have. The I turned the light on and off. It turned the computer on. I turned it on and off. That was me. Nope, I did it. Nope, I did it. I turned the light on and off. We I'm not I can't blame the ghost for that. That was me. Sorry, I didn't mean to like send you off on a wild goose chase. I'm like, I'm just gonna mess up Leaf and I'm gonna make, I'm just gonna give a bunch of wrong signals. Let's see. <laughs> Plot twist, Lonnie was the ghost after all. Yep. Just trying to keep y'all on your toes, everybody. You know, I'm a full service streamer. I'm a full service streamer. Okay, okay, nothing, nothing, nothing. Let's keep going. Let's open that just a little bit. Looking, 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 nothing in here. Looking for any bones, anything I can take a picture of. Up. Oh. Here's a bone right here, so I'm gonna set this down because I need my extra credit. I need some extra credit. Oh, look, is that a monkey paw? Ooh, that's a monkey paw. I don't know how to do that. Um, what link do we hit for the new, I don't see it on the TikTok merch. Oh, it's not in my TikTok shop. Just go to my link tree and it's in there. And let's throw that down. Doo -doo. I'm not gonna touch it, I'm gonna take a picture of it. I'm not using, okay, here's the thing y'all. Miss Paige, thank you for my high bears. I will take pictures of shit, oh, excuse my language, of stuff all day long, I'm not touching it. Not even in my little imaginary world am I touching that. Ghost is in the first bedroom. Okay. Is the light back on or something? Do you think? Extra credit. Extra credit. Looks like a turkey. Ugh. Okay, so let's go ahead and, is that what that was? It looked like a turkey. Oh, it turned on the music too, okay. Okay, let me go get my stuff in here. Let's go get some more stuff, everybody. Oops. All right, let's get this. Uh, I'm not touching it. And that. Okay. Do do. All right. Okay, and let's go ahead and set up this, set up our one and only cross. All right.
right. It's going down, but... We got some activity. Look at how brave I'm getting. I'm so brave, everybody. Okay, we have EMF five. Okay, we had an EMF-5, so let me put that. Oh, isn't that cute, Tina? Yeah. Okay, um, EMF-5. All right, let's keep going. It's another, yeah. Oh, you joined the Discord. Awesome. Do we have a brave bean? We have a very determined bean. He's all like, or the bean's like, that would be determined. Hello, Bob Moss. How in the heck are you? How in the heck and heck have you been? Do I need... Um, okay, I need to do the incense also. So let's do this really quick. Oh, Lonnie, very cool. We will be ghost hunting. We'll be team ghost hunters, just in different houses. And I like that. Oh, shit. <sighs> All right. That scared me. So let's go ahead and throw that. It's not freezing. No writing. not bad so let's get out of here oh. it does make that super creepy doesn't it okay i need extra credit y'all so we're going in with the incense and then i'll look for dots because mama needs mama needs some money all right all right we did a little incense thing. <gasps> Tina, thank you for the gift subs. It threw my book. Oh, look, it threw the book. Thank you for my gift subs, Tina. Thank you for sending those out. All right, everybody, if you just got a gift sub, you can thank Miss Tina. Um, that will be good for one month. And then after that, if you'd like to resubscribe, it is $2.99 a month. And Tina, thank you very much. I appreciate that. Yeah. Yeah, Steph, you got it back. Yay. Okay, so it's not a shade. I have one more dot. So let's go ahead. Let me see if I can't get a better. Let me go in with this. What am I doing? What am I doing? Okay, let's go in with this. Um, Is it Steph's birthday? <gasps> Steph, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Steph. Happy birthday to you. Thank you for being a part of my world. I love you very much. Thank, oh shit. 
That was not me stomping around. Did I forget to turn it on? Damn it. Good night, Caitlin. No, I didn't. I have it turned on. It's just not in the best position. Oh, much better. Um, oh no, Rono, thank you so much for purchasing the auto. We have a spirit box. We have a spirit box. You see how fast I got out of there? Okay. Okay, so I have a spirit box. See there. Ah! Little heart, thank you for hearting me. I love you too. Thank you so much. It threw the journal, so let's go. It's either the Wrath or the Twins. No. It said, it said, it said get the hell out of my house. I have no idea. I did not sit around wait enough longing to find out. Uh, Amy Hammy, thank you for hurting me. I appreciate you. Definitely no orbs. It stepped in the salt. Okay. Okay. So the twins will be freezing temps. And then the wrath but the wrath, it's if it stepped, yeah, because it stepped in the salt, right? Mm -hmm -hmm. Let's see, let's see, let's see. The wrath would be dots. And we definitely don't have dots. Okay. So let's go ahead and I'll circle the twins. Okay. So the twins, again, is freezing temperatures, spirit box, and EMF. So it's going to have to be freezing temps when I go back in. Ah! But I have pretty good. Okay. All right, let's go check. My, my character's sanity is pretty good. My real life sanity is not doing so great. So it's definitely footprints. We definitely have freezing temperatures. And no writing in the book. So we have freezing temperatures. It's the twins. Look at us go twice in a row. Yay, twinsies, twinsies. We're twinsies. All right. <laughs> Lucky, I love you. <sighs> All right. Um, Amy, Hammy just gifted a sub. Thank you, Amy, Hammy. I appreciate you. I love you so much. Thank you for making Emily a member of the Bean Team. Emily, you just got a gift sub. 
I love it. Can I see the activity board real fast? Sure. And Lucky Tay just sent out a new, another gift sub. Lucky, thank you. You know how much I love you. And Kai, you just got a subscription for one month. And if you want to resubscribe at the end of the one month, it's $2.99 a month. Samantha, this is called, um, this is called Phasmophobia. A capture a photo of the ghost, but I'm not going back in. And um, use a parabolic parabolic microphone, but I can't afford mine right now. So we're ghost hunting on a, um, we are ghost hunting on a budget. New beans, new beans. Lonnie, I just sent you some pictures of Diamond to Discord. Oh, very cool. Thank you, honey. Um, I play it on PC. I'm not 100% sure if this is anywhere else. I'm not 100% sure. Okay. New beans. New Ezra, thank you so much for the follow. Okay. All right, you ready to go? Let's do this again. I'm in the mood to get some more money. Mama's got bills to pay. I have ghost hunting equipment I need to I need to get back. Hello, Autumn, how are you? Welcome back. Uh no, I would just um in the VR thing, I would just curl up in a corner and y'all could just ghost hunt around me. It was the twins. Yes, 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 yes. This is the first time I've ever had the twins, and I agree. Lonnie, it was supposed to be out months ago, but there was a fire in the game developer building, and it got delayed. Really? Um, Miss Page says, I love you. Seriously, you take your jobs in the games. I love how seriously, oh yeah, no. You know what, when I say I am going to hunt ghosts, I'm doing the, my best job and I'm gonna give it 110%. Would you ever try VR? Um, I might. Charlie, Charlie, thank you so much for the gift sub. I appreciate you, love you lots. Veronica, you just got gifted a shub, sub from Charlie and that's good for one month and then after that, it's $2.99 a month. Um, I probably would. It's just, I do VR like I drive on my video games, and we all know how bad that is. So chances are it would not turn out very well. Okay, so I got a little bit more money. I don't want to spend it all. I don't want to go cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. But... I think I'm gonna keep everything the way that I have it. Even though I do like a motion sensor, I do would like to have that back. Um, I only need one camera. Okay, I have one camera. Um, I don't have that. I don't need my headgear. I do would like one more cross. Okay, let's go back in, everybody. <laughs> yeah, Iris, no, I'm, I, I don't want to fall, and I know my limits. Danny, thank you for my good games. I know my limits, and I think my limits are this. Um, no, I, just, I did the camp, and uh, truthfully, right now, my main purpose is to um, build up my cash flow again, because I did not. Um, I lost a lot of my money somewhere and I don't want to do that again. All right. So let's go in everybody. Yeah, it's really dark. <laughs> I don't, we don't need to break me. No, nope. Okay. So I got my two crosses back. I have my candle. I have my salt. All right, I can do. I can deal with this. This I can deal with. I am gonna have to get my tripod thingy back. Okay, Marie Mod Modsley, have a member of your ghost team witness a ghost event. Yeah, that would be me. Get your sanity below twenty five percent. That would be me, and capture a photo. We'll see. 
yes, I'm still here. I'm going to be here for probably another three or four hours. I'm, I, I do quite the long streams. I do, I do, I do. I just love hanging out with my baby beans because we have the best online community on TikTok. And I tell TikTok that all the time. And if you think I'm joking, I don't. I'm not. We really do, Lucky. And every time I talk to TikTok, um, ooh, look. Um, I tell them how amazing you all are, too, by the way. Um, do, do, do. Let's see here. And then, do you remember in Anchorman, where all the newscasters were going to, like, fight in the alley um, for, like, the number one spot for San Diego? Remember that part of the Anchorman? I always feel like every time I'm in a, a conference or a Zoom meeting with other live creators... I always feel like I'm showing up with like a Triton or something and I want to fight them because I think I have a better community than anybody else. And um, people are like, why are you so aggressive? I'm like, because I have the best community. Um, t -t -t -t. Yeah. Oh, somebody had to go. Well, that's unfortunate, but thank you. Um, I appreciate that. What they do? Now I'm curious. I don't even know what that means. Ha! Huh? Don't you love it when somebody tries to... Um, don't you love it when somebody tries to insult me and I don't even know what they mean? I'm like, it doesn't have any effect if I don't know what you're talking about. It's like calling me a, you know, like a, a something in a different language. I'll just be like... So anyway, I don't let, it was super dumb, but their username was inappropriate. Oh, okay. Got it. Thank you. Well, that's why I got my, that's why I got, that's why Elizabeth is on it. I'm telling you right now. And Angel's usually um, just as good, but she is unfortunately not here right now. So thank you, Elizabeth. Oh, just somebody had a cringy username, and I think they might have said something. Hey, Lonnie, new to following your account and absolutely love you. Ah, well, thank you, Audrey. I am so glad you're here and welcome. I appreciate you. Um, this is an amazing community and you're going to love it. And thank you so much. I'm going to have to get you a little badge, Elizabeth. I have to get you like a little moderator badge. And let's go ahead and take this. And she does, yes. And let's go ahead and go back and get some more ah, get some more stuff. Uh, what's your favorite jelly bean? Probably, oh gosh, probably like watermelon, I would say. I know that that might be a random jelly bean, but I really do like that. And I like the really random ones. The What were those jelly beans that were really super popular not too long ago and you could get just get like the weirdest ones? I really like that. Ah, thank you for my, my glasses, Elizabeth. And I appreciate you. Okay, let's go see. Let's just grab a couple more things. Bean boozled. I love it. Jelly beans. Oh, that's so cool, Sierra. Okay, that little pink bean emoji, that's a jelly bean. So you might like, you might want that one. You might like that one. Okay. <sighs> that one? I don't know if I've ever liked that one. Okay, and just a couple more things and we're off. Yeah, I just, I like the, um, I would have to say probably watermelon would probably be my favorite. Okay, and that. All right, let's go find this ghost. It's pretty active, so let's go find it. 
Izzy, thank you for my rose. And Elizabeth, thank you for my tiny dinies. I appreciate you all oh so much. So anyway, getting back to TikTok. Yes, every time I talk to them, I talk to them about you. And they're all like, oh, uh, yeah, we know about your community, Lonnie. I'm like, no, no, no. You don't know everything is amazing about them. I want to tell you again. So anyway, that's how much I appreciate you. Let's go find this ghost. Absolutely, I do. Abs okay, so we have a shoe has been thrown, which is suspicious because that shoe should not be there. We have EMF. We have EMF. And we have all of this good stuff. We have that. Izzy, thank you for my team bracelet, hon. Oh, temperatures are definitely going down. Taylor, thank you for hearting me. Let's check the breaker. Breaker is on. Breaker, breaker. And thank you for the follow, dot, 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 dot. I appreciate you. Okay. Breaker, breaker, breaker. Okay, so definitely the temperature's going down. <sighs> oh, Scully. Aw. <laughs> okay. Well, I didn't have my camera, but that's the ghost, and she's standing right there. Um, just in case you were wondering, that's the ghost that we are trying to... Um, Kaboots, thank you so much for my heart puff. Definitely the temperature's going down. <laughs> you just missed this ghost standing right here that um, made everything blow up. All right, I found the room, everybody. She's turning lights on. And let's get this going. She did look burnt, didn't she? Yeah, she definitely stayed in the tanning bed a little bit too long. Okay, let's go. It would be a nice room without the ghost. And then let's grab that. At least I don't have too far to go upstairs. Put that there. Okay, so she was standing right here. So let's maybe put this right here. So that way we can get that view. Not a five yet, so let's go. She did, that was very nice. I think she was trying to help me out in a really weird way. Oh, you know what? Did I not bring the dots in? I don't think I brought the dots in. Hello, spooky bear. Okay. Nothing yet, so let's go ahead and drop that. And let's get out of here. Nothing yet. Okay, nothing yet. Ah, oh, let's get the rest of my stuff. Okay, so let's go ahead and try this before we go. Oh, thank you, baby doll. I actually really love wearing this jacket. I know I wear it a lot, but it, I like the... Uh, hurt. Did she say something about my shirt? Did you hear that? No, I thought that she said nice shirt. And I'm all like... It's a jacket. She did, didn't she? 
<gasps> no, I don't know if I like that. Uh, because that was so creepy. Yeah, no, I was like, yeah. Uh, yeah, that was weird. I, that was, that was weird, but no, I have it programmed um, so that I don't have to talk to them. I could just, oh, she's throwing shit around. I could just, it automatically asks questions for me. Oh, shit. Ah, do I have a cross? I have a crucifix in here, right? Yes, I do. Okay, this got moved. Okay, and then I want this. Okay. Um, let's get out of here. Okay. Kinga, thank you so much for sharing my live. I wish I appreciate that. Andy says, uh, "Hello, Lenny. I just got back from dinner. Yum. What did you have?" Okay, we have orbs. So we definitely have orbs. So it's a mare, a yokai, or an onro. Oh, that sounds really good. I think they were freezing temperatures too. Okay. I'm still at 70%. Let's. So on on row, we'll need spirit box, ghost orbs, and freezing temps. A yokai will need. Spirit box, ghost orbs, and dots. And then a mare is spirit box, ghost orbs, and ghost writing. All right, so let's go back in and see what we got. I'm going to move my dots around a little bit. Hello, Jamie. I'm doing well. How are you? Okay. Mimic is still on the table also. Okay. It really is, Andy. So, ghosts. Um, this one says extinguishing a flame can cause the on row to attack. So, and then this, is that the one? No, a York. This one says, talking near a yokai will anger it, increasing the chance of attack when hunting. It can only hear voices close to it. Uh, pretty good. Only slept an hour last night, so I'm exhausted waiting for kids to go to bed, though. Yeah, go to bed. As soon as they do, you go to bed. Hello, Mads. <sighs> okay. Let's go back in and check what I have then. Because again, I have pretty much taken in, I'll just take one more of these just for, just for shits and giggles. Catherine, thank you for hearting me. Kbots, thank you for my heart puff. 
Kaylor, again, thank you for hurting me. Okay. Okay, no ghost writing, so we do not have that. We do not have the um, the, the freezing temps. And it's right behind me. Where'd my EMF go? Okay, let's go see. All right, let's see what we can do with this. I am playing, it's called Phasmophobia. Kinga, thank you again for sharing my live, everybody. Thank you for sharing my live, hon. Well, that was even worse. So I need to get it more towards the door. Let's go back in. Ah! Going back in, getting it towards the door. Tiny, tiny time. Eee! Thank you, Andy, for my tiny, tiny. My little, my little T-Rex arms are just like, There we go. Just gonna, ah, I'm getting out of your house. Don't worry about it. Phew. Okay. Now that is a good job with the dots. I'm gonna pat myself on the back on that one. Now we are gonna just sit here and wait for that sucker to walk through these dots. Thank you, Betsy. Um, I'm just waiting for the ghost. I'm getting better. I, I mean, usually I w I, in the beginning, I was so scared to even be in there that I was like, I'm just gonna throw these in here and go. Oh, no, Elizabeth, is your phone okay? Oh, it's throwing stuff. <laughs> well, I'm very crafty. Let's just put it that way. Thank you, Tara. So, okay, so if it's not giving me dots... What else do you think it could be? Because I went in and checked the temperature and it, it's not freezing. You think it's a Yoki? Okay. <laughs> you need to resuscitate. Do, do. I mean, we just got nothing, nothing, nothing. Jamie, thank you for hearting me. I appreciate you. Catherine, thank you for my cheers. I need some cheering up. Okay, so. If we cross out dots, it's this guy. And this one is, I need freezing temperatures. So I'll go back in and check for freezing temperatures. Okay, let's go back in. All right, here.
Here we go, everybody. I'm being super brave. Cole, how are you? Wani's being super brave. Jamie, thank you so much for the subscription. Jamie, I appreciate you. Jamie, welcome to the Bean family. Jamie, thank you for subscribing. I appreciate you. Oh, oh shit. Did you see it just walk by me? Did you see it just walk by me? <laughs> I'm all like singing and dancing and uh, yeah. Uh, we need a subscribing bean. I know. Okay, so I'm just gonna say that we have dots and that it's this guy. Um, they can, they can, they can terminate me if, um, if I, if they hunt me and I don't hide from them, they can, they can terminate my, my employment. <sighs> Thank you, Jamie, for my team bracelet. Um, and also, um, Jamie, let me give you a proper song. Jamie, thank you for subscribing. Jamie, you just made my night. Jamie, thank you for being a part of my bean family. I just love you outright. Thank you for being here. I appreciate you. But I got scared and I ran from a ghost and I couldn't really give you a very good song. All right, let's welcome Jamie. Let's throw out some new um, bean emotes and get the party started, everybody. Last Phoenix, thank you so much for hearting me. New beans, new beans. We got new beans. All right, all right. It's a party tonight. Oh, Dancing Queen, how was swimming? Okay. So, Leaf, are you are you confident with this one? Are you good? Everybody good? Lucky, you like this answer? Letty, thank you for my team bracelet. Latin dude, you like that? Um, okay. All right. All right, let's. Let's get going. <gasps> Last Phoenix, thank you for my game controller. Welcome back. There's some jobs ready for you. I just started playing this. I'm new to this, so you can be rusty and I'll be a an amateur ghost hunter and we will sharpen our skills together. It just makes me feel good to know I have a little bit of money in my savings account. All right, let's get going. Um, you made it active because you were singing around it. Yoki are attracted to talking. Really? Oh, wow. Then I should probably sing for my ghosts maybe more often. If it appreciates my, um, if it appreciates that. All right, everybody, hydrate, hydration station. Well, Tara, I'd rather have you have it appreciate it than, than a ghost. <sighs> okay. All right. I'm going to go use the restroom and get some more water. And then we're going to do Willow Street. Willow Street's coming up. And I will be right back. Um, ooh, grits. I love grits. All right. I'll be right back. Hydra I know we have to do, I, that's what I do too. Even when I'm not streaming and I drink water, I'm like, hydration station, Lonnie.
pet sitting vibes. Thank you for my roses. I appreciate that. All right, everybody. I think Willow Street is my favorite house. So let's do this one. Oh. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ooh, I forgot my water, too. Hold on. always forget to do that. Oh, perfect time, Matt. All right, let's do this. <laughs> That's all right. I understand what you all are trying to say. I can read between the lines. Uh, never forget the WADA. All right, let's do this, everybody. And all right, super excited. Maybe one day I'll level up again. All right, I always want to check and make sure I have my stuff. We're going after Judy Mills. I have to escape a ghost hunt, bleh, get my sanity below 25%, and repel a ghost with incense while chasing somebody. Well, that is not going to happen. So, um, yeah. Um, yeah, to get extra points. You'll get a UV upgrade when you level up. Ooh, very cool. Yeah, no, I always turn off the water when I drink because I just don't want anybody to be like, oh, that's really gross. And I'm like, glunk, 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 glunk. Because as short as I am, I really, um, sometimes I just, I, I'm not the most... Um, <sighs> refined person you could say like if I were to go to um, I'm only five foot two but like if I were to go to a fancy dinner okay let's just put it this way I actually got to go to the premiere of the golden I thought Robert was there but I got to go to the premiere of the golden bachelor you know like the whole fancy thing I met the golden bachelor blah 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 whatever so I'm in the uh, we it was at Mills restaurant on Hollywood Boulevard and so there's all these people and everybody's trying to be like all fancy and stuff. And I took two French fries and I just put them in my upper left and I was pretending to be a walrus. And um, somebody came up to me and they were like going to ask me a question. And I turned around, I had two French fries sticking out of my upper lip. And I'm just like, clunk, clunk, yeah. So uh, that's me. I go to places like that where people try to like put on a show and I pretend to be a Yeah. Oh, and the Golden Bachelor told me I was bossy. And I'm just like, whatever, dude. I'm not one of your ladies trying to, you know, impress you. I'm going to do whatever I want to do. But yeah, the Golden Bachelor told me I was bossy. But he couldn't take a picture to save his life. And I'm like, Dude, I am on social media. I've been doing this for five freaking years. I know what a good picture looks like. I know how to take a good picture. And you either do what I say or I'm not going to take a picture with you. And he's like, you're bossy. I'm like, yeah, I know. Ugh, so that's my claim to fame. But God, I can't believe they already got married. I don't know. That weirds me out. All right, we have a bathroom ghost, everybody. I will guarantee you that. Indy is following Robert around right now. 
Oh wow, we got all sorts of stuff thrown around here. All right. Oh, is she rich? Okay, she's rich and he wanted her for her money. He's always asking about her income and job. Really? Yeah. We did finish the Watchtower yesterday. I posted it on YouTube if you want to. Um, that one's recorded there. You know, I got to tell you, I don't want to talk poorly about people, but I d that does not surprise. Oh, okay. That does not surprise me uh, one little bit. You know. I knew that he was going to pick her when he was like struggling to drive in LA and you know I know that it's not easy to to drive in LA but he was like having a, like a little hissy fit over it and um and she was like it's okay baby and truthfully if I was driving in the car with him I'd be like bitch get out of the car I'll drive I'm not gonna sit there and you know tell you oh poor baby because you can't drive a car in LA you know but that's just me and that's probably why I'm single because that would have been my answer there is no way in hell I would have been like ah so anyway I the more I talk the more I realize why I'm single and I'm okay with that it's not that bad lucky and he was like having he, I thought he was gonna cry and I was, and I mean, I don't know. I've just, like I said, I, <laughs> I don't cry over driving in traffic. Do, do, do. There we go. Ah, ah, open the doors, Lonnie. So anyway, I think, it, but I personally, I don't know. I think she had an ulterior motive for marrying him too. Oh, it's the Golden Bachelor. I, I actually met the Golden Bachelor um, in Hollywood on the premiere. So, but I think that they, you know, truthfully, um, I think she had just as much of an ulterior motive as he did. Is Robert your son and Indy your puppy? Yes. Um, Robert is my oldest son and Indy is my amazingly little, beautiful, um, American Bully Pitbull. Okay. So that's that. Okay. Throwing stuff around, throwing stuff around, throwing stuff around, throwing stuff around. Go get more stuff and we'll come right back. The road raid I have when running lights and sirens. Yeah, I turn very mean. You know, but the whole thing is, is like, um, to me, I just, I don't know. It's just, I, each to their own, right? Each to their own. Let's put the camera and dots. I drove up it to LA not too long ago and it wasn't bad. It wasn't great, but it sure wasn't bad. Do, 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 do user 660868647. Thank you so much for all of my roses. I did not shut that. I never know where to put All right, I get it, I get it, I get it. Okay, let's go. Oh my gosh, that is, it's a good EMF reader, but damn. Okay. Camera is backwards. Yeah, it's still raining. It rained really bad today. All right, 
So let's see what we got. Okay, door. Oh, you're right. So we have you at ultraviolet. Let me fix my. Okay, let's get out of here. Oh, what is that? It's very, um, it's very tuneful. Let's just put it that way. You think it's a poltergeist? Okay. You know, truthfully, when I was, um, when life got really hard, I could see how I could have had road rage because to me it was like I was one step away from losing my sanity. Um, so it would, I'm glad nothing, I'm glad I never had that experience, but I could see how I could have, I could have probably back in a, a former life. Sad, thank you for hearting me. I appreciate you. <sighs> Uh, okay. So if you think it's a poltergeist, then we're going to need spirit box, ultraviolet, and ghost writing. Okay. So let's get, let's go in with these two things and let's see what we can do. Oh, Lonnie, don't go in the street. Andy, thank you for hearting me. Oh, I oh I do have ghost writing. Okay. So let me put that. I know, that's what I was thinking. Could it be twins or a mimic? It's a very busy ghost. Throwing stuff in here now. Where's my thermometer? Oh, it's through my camera. Not freezing. But I think for Poltergeist, it was supposed to talk on the little thingy, right? Is 
it's a spirit box ultraviolet. EMF for, okay. No, it, the EMF has been going off the entire time, Andy, but it's just, it's not getting to a five. Angel! Angel Tina's on. She was asking about you. And Betsy, too. Do, do, try spirit box in the adjacent room. Okay. I'm still at 77. It's very active. So let's go. Let's go grab my camera and the EMF. Let's see what we can find. Okay. Oh, it turned on the light also. Oh, it just stopped to hunt. This is called phasmophobia. Okay. Let me check. Yeah, it's doing good. Squeeze, thank you for sharing my live. Sherry, thank you for my tiny diny and my hand hearts. Kay, thank you for following. I appreciate that. All right, so let's see what we got here. I'm thinking. Because I checked the temperatures the last time I went in. So it's definitely not... Oh, why did I have ghost writing? It wasn't ghost writing. It wasn't spirit box. There was ghost. Oh, I was looking at the wrong book. Okay, sorry. I was looking at the wrong book. Okay, ghost. A demon is... Freezing temps. Yeah, I, I have two books in there, and I was looking at the wrong one. And a miling is an EMF-5. And a poltergeist again. It's a spirit box. Okay. No, it didn't, it didn't, um, it did not, okay. No, it's not timed, Billy. Really. Well, it's not timed, but the thing is, is that the more times I go in, um, the more sanity I lose. Mag Magwire, thank you so much for my paper crane. I appreciate you very much. Thank you, honey. Oh, it's 
freezing temps. We got freezing temps finally. We finally got freezing temps. Ha! I was like, I'm done. I'm done. Whew. Yes, Jeremy, we got it. Ugh. It was a demon. That's the first time I've ever survived a demon one. Um, okay, so what was your username before? Um, oh, it's E. Okay, yay. Well, thank you for my paper crane. That was E. Okay. Your user profiles are like that big. All right, let's get going, everybody. Leaf, thank you for gifting a subscription. I appreciate you so much, not only for your ghost hunting um, assistance, but for every time you gift a sub and live. Um, Leaf just gave you a gift sub, good for one month. After that, if you want to resubscribe, it's two ninety nine a month. Yes, I got a new UV light. But I don't have enough money. Okay, I'll have to make more money. Mm. Which one was that, Veronica? Which one was she asking about? Libby, thank you so much for my heart puff. Oh, morticians, yeah. I don't play that one anymore just because of the whole addiction backstory thing. Just, I can't do it. Jessica, thank you for my heart puffs, honey. Um, it's just, it's just it, it just doesn't set well with my soul, so I don't play that one. I don't play that one. Okay, so let's get going. Let's do this house again. And then after this, I think we're going to try the new spot, the anomaly game. So let's go ahead and go one more time ghost hunting. And then we're going to, we're going to do some spot, the anomaly. And that was called death watch. And it's, it was, I tried it out earlier and it seems really cool. It seems really cool. It seems really cool. Look at me. I'm level 21. I almost look like a professional, um, uh, ghost hunter. I played it newly sober and was like, well, damn it, I'm done playing Jeremy. Yeah, I've been sober now for nine years. And I was like, why am I grinding my teeth? Why is this so unpleasant? And I was like, oh, that's why. The mortician's assistant. Okay, let's go get Walter. I need to have to escape a ghost hunt. I cannot repel it while it's chasing me. Oh, and I don't have my microphone yet, so I'm good. So, yeah, you know what, Sad? It, you know what, truthfully, it, 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 and if it wasn't quite as graphic as they made it, maybe just tone that down a little bit, it would have been perfect. I agree. I agree. Um, good to know I only played it on the trout. Yeah, it's, uh, if I, yeah, it, I mean, it's, it's very cringe in the whole, like, um, in the whole, like, autopsy thing. But again, the backstory was very graphic and very dark. <sighs> Let's see here. 
let's see here what we got. It would be nice if we had another. I never knew that turned on. That's kind of cool. Okay. Nothing thrown around here this time, so we're good there. Oh, gosh, no, not at all. Not at all. No, 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 no. And please don't ever apologize for asking questions like that. I'm very honest and very transparent about my um, sobriety, and I would rather talk about it because there could be other people out there who maybe have the same thoughts and feelings, but they're not as comfortable talking about it. So, gosh, no. Um, I don't, please don't ever apologize for anything like that. Please, please, please. Yep, nope, nope, de nope, nope, nope. And I think it's really very healthy to talk about like your triggers and stuff like that because it might help somebody else figure out what triggers them. And so I'm very, very um, transparent and very open about that. Squeak, thank you for hurting me. I hurt you too, my friend. Um... Oh, very good, Angel. Congratulations, hon. To Veronica, thank you for my roses. Oh, please don't be down here. I hate this basement. Oh, okay, we got that. Wendy, thank you for my rose. And Squeak, thank you for my rose. Okay, the power is off. Let's hit that breaker. Breaker, breaker, we are going to fix you. Breaker, breaker, where are you at? Let's go, let's go, let's go. <gasps> that ass, it flipped my breaker as soon as I did. <sighs> Only if it causes for extra credit. And let's see here. I am still on, I'll be on for a while. I'll be on for at least another two hours or so. All right, let's see if that worked. Okay, finally. All right, let's throw this down here. Let's throw that down there. I want to go get some more stuff. And um, after this, we're doing a really cool new spot, uh, spot the anomaly game that I just found. That one, um, we're doing that one, and then we might try a back rooms game also. Alyssa, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. Hello, uh, how are you doing? Okay, so let's get rid of that. Let's go back down and take a picture. Looks like he threw that there. Go down, take a picture. Up oh, through something here, too. Do we see anything else for extra credit? Looking for extra credit stuff. Looking for extra credit. Okay. Um, keep it plausible. Um, okay, so let's go back in and see if we can't pinpoint exactly where we have this. So temperature's going up a little. Temperature's going up a little. Christy, thank you for my rose, hen. I appreciate you. Uh, 
Um, okay. All right, let's get going. Let's get going. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Not here. I'm really hoping it's... Oh, you know what? I haven't been in the garage yet either. But let's go check down here because this is originally where we were. And they turned that light off. Darn it. <sighs> I'm sorry, Elizabeth. You could always um, book a vacation out here and I will ship it out here. All right, I think we have that in here. All right, I found the room. Damn it. This is like my least favorite spot. I think that would be exciting. Okay, we're okay. And let's put that there. My sub ends February 12th. Well, you can always renew for 2.99 a month. Um, I'm not a hundred percent sure. I think it's an app only, but I'm not a hundred percent sure. My tea baby, my night's been really good, really good. Mm -hmm. Really, 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 really good. Um. All right, so let's go on down. Let's put this here. Do, 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 and I guess since I don't have my stand, let's put that there. And let's put that there, I guess. Not super thrilled with that one, but I'm super not. Oh, I don't like that at all. I don't like that at all. I think almost on the floor would be better. And okay, just trying to throw things at my head. That's fine. I think that would be better. Um, oh good, I'm glad that you're better. I'm glad that you're at least feeling better. I know, we gotta have to, let's, let's try to not talk about, um, let's try to turn our conversations a little bit lighter than uh, passing on the toilet. If we don't mind. Tia, thank you for my heart. I appreciate that. Because you have to remember, I do watch the conversations. Okay, let's go check. Nope, it's still pretty low.
Oh, we have UF. There we go. Okay. Okay, and let's get rid of that. And let's try. Yeah, I do. I am asking it questions. I have it um, set up so that they're text questions. Because I'm super fancy ghost hunter. And it's still not freezing. So let's go check our dots. You know what? I don't have a cross. Ooh, I thought I did. Let's go grab one. Um, I don't think being in the top ranking is just about likes. I think it's about gifts also. It's a combination of everything. It's gifts, it's subscriptions, it's likes, it's comments, it's interactions. It's a whole... Uh, it's a whole bag of all D, all of the above. Um, I actually have really been all about this Melt Cosmetics. Um, it's called Ah Elizabeth. Ah! Thank you. Uh, thank you for my Leon, my Leon the kitty. I appreciate you. Um, it's, I've been wearing this Melt Cosmetics. It's based off my astrological sign and it's all about fire. And I really have been liking that one a lot. Did you see the dots? Okay. All right. I will take your word for it that we have dots. And then I know I love my Leon. Thank you, honey. Sad. Thank you for my puff hearts. Thank you so much. Okay, so let's see. Okay, so let's see what we got. If you can't see the dots in person, it's Euro. Um, you can see it in the monitor. Ooh. So let's go ahead and put that down there. And let's try different dots. Tia, thank you for my roses. And Sad, thank you for my puff hearts again. And Elizabeth, thank you for my Leon. I really do love him. I do love him. I know. It's like, I feel like I have a, um, I feel like I have an expert ghost hunter on, on my, Lucky, thank you. Ah. <laughs> thank you, Lucky. I appreciate that. Uh-oh. He always makes me so happy. That scared me. That scared me. Lucky. I appreciate that. Timmy, thank you. How are you doing, honey? <laughs> oh, wow. Elizabeth, I got the airdrop and the whales. Thank you. Oh, wow. Thank you, Elizabeth. And thank you, Lucky. I love you both so much. You take my energy and you make it so amazing. And I love you so, so much. You just make my day with the little kitty cats. And I appreciate you. Ah, Danny, thank you for my ducks on parade. And sad, thank you for my cuddle party. You know, I got to tell you, I am a cuddler. I do like to cuddle. And Trina, I love you too so, so much. <laughs> Georgia, thank you for my confetti. I love you all so, so much. Yay, Nanny, thank you for my tiny diny. You are all amazing. Danny, thank you for hearting me, honey. 
I appreciate you. Okay, so we got Andy. Thank you for my tiny diny. Georgia, thank you for my star. And Lucky, thank you for my game controllers. Thank you, Lucky, so, so much. Ha! Elizabeth, thank you for my cuddle party. And Hobby Koi, thank you for hearting me. And we just jumped up to ranking number 87. Tina, thank you for my heart. Thank you for my heart. Cat, thank you for my fire. <laughs> like I'm Robert. Georgia, thank you for my, my hat and my mustache. I always look like Robert. Phoenix, last Phoenix, thank you for my team bracelet. Yep. We got back up into Jessica. Thank you for my Rosa. Woo! Look at us go. Thank you for my, my finger hearts. I appreciate and love you all so much. <sighs> Going to the top. That's right. And I'm bringing all my beans with me. Nobody's ever seen anything like us. Us, and we are just. We're gonna make. We are gonna make a. We're just gonna redefine how people think about streaming. Georgia, thank you for my my corgi. Yay, Corgi! Kat, thank you for my Rosa. And Tia, thank you for cheers. <gasps> Elizabeth, thank you for my coral. That was so pretty. And Nanny, thank you for my, my finger heart. Oh my gosh, now we are number 82. Bean Gang, ah, Lucky, thank you for my gold. Ah, it's rain and gold. Thank you, Lucky. It's rain and gold. And thank you for my roses. Oh, what was that? Number 80, Lucky Tay. Thank you for my ducks on parade. And thank you for my heart puff. Cat, thank you for my heart puff. Uh, Maguire, thank you for my crane. Izzy, thank you for my tiny diny. Angel, thank you for my confetti. And Anne, thank you for my good game. Number 79. We have orbs, <laughs> and it's a gift wave. It's a gift wave. And we have orbs, which I'm so thankful for. And thank you for my, my corn and my ice cream and my good game. And we have orbs. Izzy, thank you so much for my heart puff. All right, it's a banshee. Tina, thank you for my confetti. And Georgia, thank you for my heart puff. Happy Tuesday, everyone. Izzy, thank you for my high bear. Look at my little sub wave. Yay! Look at that. Georgia, thank you for my heart puff. Jessica, thank you for my duck song parade. Thank you for my team bracelet. And Elizabeth, thank you for my duck song parade. Jessica, thank you again. Thank you for my ducks on parade. Angel, thank you for my cheers. Danny, thank you for my controller. Squeak, thank you for my heart. Anne, thank you for my heart. Thank you, Anne, for my good game. Lauren, thank you for my perfume. And thank you for my TikToks. And I don't want to miss anyone. Danny, thank you for my controller. Kat, thank you for sending a sub. Thank you so much. And again, thank you for my roses. Katie, thank you for my cheers. And Anne, thank you for my finger hurt. And we got orbs. <laughs> I cannot not say thank you to somebody. So that's just all I have to say about that. <sighs> all right. So I got to say hello. I mean, I have to say thank you to everybody. Sierra, thank you for my roses a lot. Eli, thank you for my finger heart. Leaf, thank you for my perfume. I appreciate you all so much. We are number 79. <sighs> I think once we realized the gifts helped bring Lonnie up in the ranking, we said we got this. Nanny, you were all like, I could hear a stampede of beans. You're all like, we're coming. We're coming in. <laughs> it's like, we ride at dawn. All right. I'm thinking that we are good. Yeah, nobody messes with the beans. That's for sure. <laughs> we understood the assignment. All right, everybody, hydration station. Uh, 
Okay. All right. I'm pretty sure I have the right one. So I'm going to pack this up and we're going to try a new, um, we're going to try a new spot the difference game. And I'm going to see what you think about it. Let's see what we think about that. Let's just see what we think about this. Let's rock. That's right. Look at this. We, I actually am in the positive tonight. I am so excited about that. <sighs> Yay. Yes, yes, yes. All right, let's go. Tonight's a good night. I agree, Lucky. It's been a really fun night tonight. I think it's because I'm wearing my hoodie and my denim jacket. Um, and I, everybody's like, yeah, you know what? We know the assignment. We know what's going on. All right. Um, oh, Yarn Moth. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Yarn Moth Creations. Happy birthday to you. I appreciate you being in here. I appreciate you being a bean. I appreciate you and happy birthday and I love you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Thank you for spending it with us. All right, let's get going. I wonder if this is in here. Let's see. Duh. Nope, so we will say other. Other games. Okay. Do do. Let's see what we got here. All right. Let's do this. Let's do this. Tia, thank you so much for purchasing an auto subscription. I appreciate it immensely. Okay, so let's start the game. We're gonna just start off on normal until we can kind of get an idea of how this works. But let me give you a little rundown about how it works. What we do is we start here at North Pines, all right? We all know how to we all know uh, this is an amazing community we all know how anomaly games work except on this one a little bit different um so what we do is we're going to be looking at four no six different places all right we have a shed a porch a path a driveway our room that we're sitting in and then katie Thank you, Katie, for purchase a subscription. Welcome to the beans. Katie, I appreciate you and I love you and I wanna let you know that you are amazing. And Katie, thank you for subscribing. All right, everybody, send Katie a new bean. We got a baby bean. Let's go, we got some new beans. We got Katie, she's now an official bean. All right, so this is a new game. So we're looking at these six different places, all right? We have a shed, a porch, a path, a driveway, our room, and then the graveyard. And then these are the things that we're looking for. We're looking for an audio threat where the ghost is gonna say something, um, an audio gore like <clears throat> audio help, help. Um, just like maybe a little pool of marinara sauce, a camera malfunction, a door manipulation, an extra object, um, orbs, entity sighting. Yarn Moth, thank you so much for subscribing. Happy birthday. Thank you for doing that. Happy birthday. Thank you for being a bean. Amy, happy birthday, Amy. Everybody send out Amy a new, um, a new baby bean. Amy, thank you for subscribing. I appreciate you. I think you are amazing and I love you and I appreciate you. So we have feet print or hand prints, light, um, a lighting problem, an object can move, an object can disappear. There could be a symbol, a victim or writing. All right, you got all that? There's a lot of lots to talk about here. 
So then what we do is here's where we start licking. All right. Stay frosty, beans. So here's the porch. Take a look at the porch. Here's the path. We have the lights. We have the stuff on the table. Um, here's the driveway. We have the brake lights, the headlights, all of this stuff. We have a graveyard where the gates open, the tombstone is um, knocked down. We're back in the shed. We have the porch again. I don't think that light was on. Yeah, I don't quite understand the whole layout of this one. I don't think I would want to live in a graveyard, nor would I want to have a picnic in a graveyard. But, you know, that's just me. And then we have all of this. Okay, so now here's our first example, okay? So the graveyard has a camera malfunction. So we're going to go graveyard and then camera malfunction. And I'm going to log this event. Doo -doo, doo -doo. Okay, event log successful, but we need more data. So we're going to go back. But first thing I'm going to do is I, this is the room that we're setting in, all right? The, the door is open. I don't know why I am doing my surveillance with the door open. There's a mannequin in the back. Apparently, I have boxes all over the place. All right, so that's the room that we're setting in. So we have to watch the room we're setting in just as much as we have to watch the surveillance cameras. Because that just moved. That wasn't there just a minute ago, was it? Vanilla, thank you for the follow. I appreciate that. But the, the mannequin was always there in front of the bed? No, it moved. Yeah. Yeah, it definitely moved. Okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to come back and we're going to say our room um, object moved. And then I'm going to log this event. Do, do. Okay, so it's saying um, that now I have to see how it has the minus one. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cross out the one because it's a minus one. Okay, so then what we're going to do is once we have the code figured out, we're going to put it here. And this is what's going to chase the ghost anomaly away. Okay, do you all kind of have like the idea? Uh, okay, Izzy. So I thought that this was a really cool new kind of way to do a spot the anomaly. And I hope that you all agree. All right, so let's go. Let's go back and look. All right. So we're going in and there's all different places that we can unlock the more we play this. So let's go ahead and look. So stay frosty, everyone. Yeah, Paige, I thought that this was a nice little twist to the um, spot the spot the anomaly difference. Okay. So, Casey, the um, the door wasn't open. Okay, let's look. Because that door's always been open, right? This door's been closed. Stacy, thank you for the follow. Um, why does it have a mic in the corner? Can the game hear you? Or that comes later on in the whole in the game. It cannot hear me right now. That it cannot hear me at this moment. Okay. Um, don't see anything here. Oh, 
Well, we have something in the shed that's not quite human that, let's go ahead and report that. So the shed has, I would say, an entity sighting. Would you call that an entity sighting? Yeah. Let's go ahead and log that in. Okay, so now I'm going to, it says minus red four, so I'm gonna cross that one out. So let's go ahead and look around our room. Okay, I'm gonna look around. Doors still open for some unknown reason. That's still there. Okay. And that is still, nothing is still, okay, everything looks good. Okay. So let's keep going. Ah, lucky. You know what? It's every every time I'm in a scary situation, my I leave the door open. So, <laughs> you know what, Georgia? You and me both. I am sitting here, and I'm like, one of these times, I'm going to turn around. There's going to be something there. Headstone missing. Let's look. Oh. The shed um, has a light. Nanny, thank you for my heart puff. And Stacy, thank you for my heart puff. So let's report the shed lighting first. So the shed has a lighting problem. I just heard something behind me. I don't know if you all heard that, but I heard something behind me. So as soon as I am done here, I think we're going to look behind us because I heard something. And let's see what I heard, because I heard something. Okay. That's new. So let's go ahead. And we are going to... Let's go ahead and say our room has... Um... An extra object. Don't you agree? Because I didn't see it before. Stacy, thank you for harding me. Um, oh, no, no, no. It was in here. Extra object. Okay. So let's go ahead and put that. Okay, so minus six. All right, let's keep going, everybody. Oops. Okay. So did you notice something at the graveyard, I think? Um. And we're in the driveway. We're going to report the driveway that we heard audio gore. I would say that would be gore. Yeah. Yeah, because it sounded like somebody was like, <coughs> so let's report that. Okay, so minus three blue. Okay, and let's get going. <laughs> I don't, sad, it's a good game. Okay, missing headstone. Yes, because remember that one headstone had fallen down. So one, yes. Okay, so let's go graveyard. Graveyard is a missing object. Object disappearance. And let's log that in. Minus blue five. Oops. Oh, shoot. Mm -hmm. 
I think I need to check behind me more often. <sighs> That's like a big nope. Stacy, thank you for hearting me. All right, let's try again. Okay, so now we have kind of an idea of how to play the game. So let's get going. I know, it was like, all right, let's go in. Oh, that's all right, Eva. I'm glad that you're here. Cool. Yes, Leaf, I think that this has a lot more to it than observation duty. All right, everybody. Stay frosty, my friends. What do we got? What do we got? And is that like something in the back? Does that look? <laughs> I saw that, sad. Okay. Um, okay, we have all that. Good night, Tina, honey. Thank you. I, I will. Um, I'm glad you're here. You made my night. Once you go through it, I'll check the room. Okay. Okay. Okay, we have the messy boxes. No mannequin. Just a Disney lover. Thank you for my cheers. And there's the mannequin, but it's over there. Okay. Okay, we have this again. Okay. Don't see anything. Good night, cat. Oh, so let's do the graveyard is graveyard is a camera malfunction. Just a Disney lover. Thank you for hearting me. All right, let's go ahead and look. Let's keep an eye on our back a little bit more because we did not do very good. It looked like something just moved, but I can't see what it was. Okay. I swear something moved too, Jenny boy. Yeah. Sh do you want to just report a missing object and see if maybe it, we can't figure out what it was? Yeah, okay. Missing object. Object disappearance. It was a plant. Okay, Lucky. Awesome, thank you. Okay, minus green three. Good job, everybody. Okay, so here we go again. And there we go again. Here we go again. The grave. The post, oh, okay. Is there a body here in the driveway? Um, it is the light above the table. Wasn't it always off? <gasps> oh. Let's 
Linda man's hanging out in the back way of the driveway. Okay, well, I don't see him, so I'll go ahead and just report it. So is it an entity? Um, what do you want me to call it? It's a victim. Victim or limbs? Okay. So it's it's in the Okay, hold on. Oh, I see him now. I see him now at the top. Okay, so yeah, that's a victim. That's the path victim. Hold on. Minus green five. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to report in my room. I heard, I heard an audio threat because we heard something. Okay. Ah! Okay. Okay, driveway. Door manipulation. Okay. Okay, so this is the graveyard again. So graveyard. <sighs> graveyard, camera malfunction. Okay, so there's somebody in the driveway. Okay. So the driveway, we have an entity. Um... It says you weren't meant to find me. It said it, well, you were not meant to find me. What the heck? I'm hoping I looked in time. It just says you weren't meant to find me. So let's go, let's go, let's go. Hold on, everybody. I'm going to see. Okay. I just wanted to lighten it up a little bit just for everybody. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So let's go shed uh, blood and gore. Got it. Oh, hurry, hurry, hurry. <sighs> Minus two. Okay, looking around, looking around, looking around. Good, I'm glad you all like it. I am. I'm looking. I'm looking. Uh, hello. I hear something. OK, 
Okay, I don't see anything. Okay. All right, let's go back. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, nope, he got us. But we lasted longer, you know? We're getting better at it, we're getting better. Okay, Kat, thank you for the follow. Tay, thank you for my roses, and Stacy, thank you for my team bracelet. Okay. Yeah, it is a lot of fun. <laughs> Cat's all like, no. Ooh, we have Murphy's Farm, Hellbound Hospital, and a Labs, too. Okay. Lucky, thank you for my hi, my little puffy hearts. All right, everybody. I'm going to start looking behind me a lot more. Okay, okay. Okay, so let's look behind me. Aw, Elizabeth, thank you for my happy baras. Those are so cute. Happy baras. We're just a dancing because we're happy baras. Michelle, thank you for my roses. I appreciate you. Okay. Let's keep going, everybody. All right, doors closed. Everything looks good. I don't see anybody in. Let's see here. Bambi, thank you for the follow. Angel, thank you for the follow. Okay, I don't see anything here. Door shut. Um, graveyard, in graveyard on right side, extra stones. I can, I, I'll report it because at this point I want to make sure. So graveyard. Um, extra object. Let's just see what it is. Yeah. If not, the only thing, nope, the only thing is, is I can't report anything for 10 seconds. Oh, sorry. Let's go ahead. I want to look. Okay, let's look, look, look. Michelle, thank you for my heart puff. I think the scariest thing for me about this game is the thunder. I mean, it's kind of a, it's a good game, but thunder scares me. Okay, so we have our mannequin back. So let's go ahead and report our room extra object. All right, all right. Minus blue five, got it, okay. Let's go, let's go. Let's go, my little ghost hunters. Good night, Cole. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I know that mannequin. Between the mannequin having a better shape than me and grandma having a boyfriend, this is really hitting my ego. Okay. Okay, nothing so far. Okay, go again. And okay, well, we have uh, audio on path. So path would be Audio help, um, audio threat. I wonder if it was in my room. Maybe the audio wasn't in the there, it was in my room. Uh, 
Oh, that makes sense. Okay. Oh, look. Look at that. It looks like a face up there. I wish I could zoom in. Okay. I don't like that. Nope, me neither. Okay. Hello? Hello? Now, do you think that that was an audio on, that was an audio threat? Okay. Audio threat on the porch? Because I can't do audio, so I'm going to do it on porch. Oh, it was in... It was one of those. Nope. So, I don't know, Danny. Shed, okay. Um, yep, that, it was in the shed. Okay, looking around, looking around, because I'm looking around more. <gasps> looking around, looking around. Ooh, got to look at those windows up there, too. Looking around. Okay, let's go back. I know, Lucky, I love it. It's tense, it's scary, but it's not overly gory. Just like what we've been looking for. Okay, we got this. I want to make sure this guy stays away from me. Thank you for the follow, Reagan. I appreciate that. Okay, let's go back. Reagan, thank you for hearting me, honey. I appreciate that very much. Doors open on the porch. Okay. Oh, yep. So let's report the porch. Porch, door manipulation, and let's go. Hydration station, everybody. What, what, what? Okay, okay, okay. Okay. It's, we're going to alleviate, by process of alleviation, we are going to come up with a code and that code is going to get rid of the thing that's trying to get me. And I think the door's always been open in the shed. Oh, Izzy, that is so cool. I absolutely love it. So the door, we already reported that one open, right? Hello, Michaela. Jeez. Okay, that scared me. Did you see my mouse moving all around? Okay, so that one was my room. What would you call that one? Um, an entity sighting? Um, this is called um, 
Death Watch. Uh, let's just try entity sighting. Nope. Heart stopping in my room. I agree. Okay, there's our buffed mannequin. And you have to realize each and every time we play, we last longer and we live longer. And to me, that's the exciting part about learning new games. The lighting in my room. Okay. Hello, Kaylin, how are you? So my room, lighting. <sighs> Nope. I'm doing good. Okay, let's go back. Oh, there's a, um, some legs in the doorway. We have some legs in the doorway. So shed, we have uh, da, 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 da. victim or limbs. Okay. Okay, minus blue. So blue. Okay. What? What? Oh! <gasps> no! I didn't even think about looking up. Okay, let's go ahead and report my room. We have writing. Um, is it writing? Okay. Okay, so that was correct. I want to look again. Holy guacamole, Batman. I didn't even... Oh, look, a cute little puppy, though. Okay, let's look Rick, here. So the door's open. There's a shadow next to the mannequin. Okay. Oh, this is Graveyard. Let me report this really quick. Graveyard lighting. Ah, what would that be? Oh, camera malfunction. So graveyard camera malfunction. Oh, I hear somebody walking up behind me. Minus blue six. That shadow thing is actually like, um, it's almost like, uh, like my flashlight's dirty or something. Okay. Ah, uh, Sap, thank you so much for my heart. I appreciate you. Okay, let's go back. Uh. What the hell? Mm. 
No, the body's still there. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you for the follow. <sighs> What's in the graveyard, hon? Writing in the graveyard? Okay, writing at uh, the grave. Okay. Okay, writing in the graveyard. Okay. Minus five red. Okay. Oh, did you see him? Oh, no. <sighs> so we're going to report that. As my room, we have an entity sighting. Crashing? Are you done? Okay. Okay. Hello, Sexella. How are you? Okay. Shed door. Okay. That's camera malfunction in the shed, also. The door's closed more, but it's um, that body's still there. Minus six green. <gasps> Hello. Oh, he was looking at me. Okay, let's just go ahead and report that in my room. We have another entity sighting. Minus one blue. Okay. So now what we do, we know that this one here is a three. Do you get what I'm doing now? Since this one right here, the only number left on blue is a three, I put that one there. Okay. <sighs> okay. I will put door manipulation, so shed door manipulation. Yep, we just need more information. Thank you, everybody. You all are amazing ghost hunters. <sighs> okay, let's look. This is fun, isn't it? Yeah. I knew you all were going to like this when I was playing it today. So let's go. Oh, we have blood in the shed. We have blood in the shed, but I want to look around really quick. Okay, so we have shed... We have blood. <sighs> okay, minus red three. Okay, okay, okay. What? Hello? Hello? Okay. Okay, let's go. Camera malfunction in the driveway. 
Hurry, 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 hurry. What's knocked over? Minus red one. Okay, hold on. <gasps> oh, no, 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 no. Cheese and rice, Angel, I agree. Ah, I said entity. Now it got me. It got me, everybody. Graveyard. I can hear it talking, or I can hear it walking. I don't have any lights. I'm trying to get my can't my thing back, and it won't let me have it back. Okay, let's keep going, everybody. Up oh, shed is lighting. Writing on the walls in the graveyard. I thought we already had that. Minus green. Graveyard writing. Okay, where's the batteries? I thought we did too, but maybe there's more writing. Oh, this round has lasted much longer. Okay. Oh, I ran out of batteries. Oh, okay. I guess I'll have to be more careful next time. This is called Death Watch, and it is actually really cool. Find me. Oh! Okay, and which place was that? Is there an extra gravestone? On the porch? Okay. Uh, missing extra object. Object's disappearance. Okay. Okay, green, good job. Minus green five. Can I have some extra batteries, please, sir? I don't think I can do audio in my room. It won't let me do audio in my room. Hello, Mackie Doodle, doing really good. Hello, Shelly. Extra batteries. <laughs> I 
Movement on porch. Okay, writing. Let's see. Right, y'all, I'm not seeing anything, but I'm like all freaked out over here. Writing on the porch, okay. Oh, yep. We are so close. Um, tires to swing missing. Okay. On, and where would that be? What area? Where was the tire swing at? Driveway. Okay. Driveway object disappearance. Oh, come on. Okay, mine is, oh, we're so close. <gasps> no! Ugh, we need more time! <sighs> Sky Ann, thank you for the follow. Jeez, I'm doing good tonight. How are you? Oh, you're gonna have a busy day. Okay, honey. Well, I'll miss you. It's a wild card. Uh, wild card Wednesdays. All right, let's go again, everybody. Oh, leaf. Okay. So basically, no matter what, I, I, it's, I think at a certain point, it's Sage, thank you for my fires. At a certain point, it's going to um, go out on me. So, all right, everybody, let's get this. Okay, Danny. All right, you ready? Let's go. Baby bean level. You know, we're going to get it. Ah, Sab, thank you so much for the subscription. I appreciate you. You are bean number. Oh, I can't even tell you what bean number you are, but I appreciate you. You're my new baby bean, and I love you, and I want to tell you thank you. This is an amazing community, and I'm glad you're here. Thank you, honey. Thank you for the subscription. Okay, there's our puppy. 1,000, your B number, 1,157. Um, whenever I have like a little mini su um, sub wave, it takes away my counter. But that's okay. That is perfectly okay. All right, let's keep going, everybody. Oh, lights in the shed. So shed, lighting. No, um, Leaf looked it up, and I it's going to go out after I find the third ghost. So it's going to go out one way or the other. So it's not that I used all the batteries, just part of the game. Of course we can name the puppy. What do you want to name the puppy? What would you like to name that puppy? Humphrey, 
Cujo. That's a good one too. Ah, <gasps> uh, bean sprout. I like that one. Paige, I think that I think that was our puppy's name is Bean Sprout. All right, let's keep an eye on everything, everybody. Oh, there's an entity there in the bush. The path. Um, an ent an entity sighting. <gasps> our beanie's good too. Minus red. Okay, let's keep going, everybody. Do, do. Let's keep looking. Let's keep looking. I like Bean Sprout too. That's our puppy's name. Will be Bean Sprout. Little Bean Sprout, because it's a little puppy. Oh, lucky your mom's dog is named Beans. That's so cute. Okay, let's keep going, everybody. F stay frosty, my friends. Oh, the headstone's missing. Graveyard. Uh, missing object. Minus red one. Got it. All right. Looking around again. The headstone, yeah. Pandora, this is a um, spot the anomaly difference, but I'm being hunted by a ghost while we're looking for it. So it's actually really cool. It's actually very cool. Okay. Do do. Hello, Eva. Let's go. Oh, is the mannequin missing? Nope, that mannequin's supposed to be there. And then when the other one pops up, that's the anomaly. Entity and path, okay. Is it still there? Door manipul um, shed door, okay. Shed door manipulation, okay. Okay, minus green. Um, I don't see any, it was top left, okay. We will keep an eye open on it. Shelly, thank you for the follow. So graveyard, I'm going to call that. That scared me. Nope. I think that might have been in my room. But it was spooky looking. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, let's do this, everybody. Okay, we have blood and gore in the shed. Okay, let's keep going. Yep, let's look around. Thunder scares me every single time. Yeah, Lucky, this game is fun. I love the little twist to it. Okay, let's keep going. Door still shut. I'm sitting here like I'm so tense. It's right there. That one's there. And the other one isn't. Yeah, there's blood in the shed. The 
other one's missing, but the other one's not supposed to be here. It's only when that one will pop up and then that will be a, um, a new object. Yeah, I reported the, the blood, oh, the lighting in the shed. I reported the blood in the shed already. Oh, wait, no, that's a camera malfunction. Yeah, it's kind of, well, kind of, yes, and but you'll see ghosts and stuff like that. Having a good memory definitely helps, but you'll see like um, like ghosts and stuff like that also. Stuff like that also. Okay. Keep going, keep going. I don't see any writing yet. Body on path. Oh, got it. Okay. Uh, victim and limbs. Minus blue four. Uh, hello? Okay. <sighs> I think um, we'll probably might do some back rooms also. Guy's just gonna hang around. Jen, my little, my little buttercup. Was the door? Di is there a door manipulation right there? Is that a, because I thought the door was open more. Okay, so should I report that as a door manipulation? Is that what you're saying? Okay. Okay. No, so Anne, there's a, okay, so on the porch, we have a missing book. And then what was going on in, so minus blue two. So what was the other one that I need to get? I got the book, the, manne the mannequin. I thought the mannequin was, oh, the mannequin's, is not supposed to be there. There was a light by the car. Okay. Entity in the left corner of graveyard. Okay. So graveyard entity sighting. Oh, you weren't supposed to meant to find me. Okay. So now, oh. Uh, yeah. Okay, so let's report your room entity sighting. Minus green five, okay. That was a close one, yes it was. I mean, I thought the mannequin uh, was not supposed to be there, but if you want me to retry to report it, I definitely will. Ha, <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> well, thank you. I love you too. Okay. Okay. It's not supposed to be there. That's what I thought. That's what I thought. Okay. Okay, so that's a lighting issue. And that was driveway lighting. And then I have to look in my room. Yeah. As long as bean sprouts, okay. Yeah, the gate was always open in the, um, yes, yes, it was open. I saw that. Okay. 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 Bean sprouts, okay. <clears throat> Blood on the graveyard gate. Okay. I'll go back and look. Uh, I think that's shadows, though. This is supposed to be open, but it looks like shadows from where I can see it. Okay. Oh, we have the limb. We have it back in the door. So we have the shed. We have a limb. Body parts back in the door. Yep. This tire swing is gone again? Okay. And that was in the driveway, right? Driveway. We have limbs, everybody. Oh, shit. There's a symbol in shed. Okay. Hang in there, bean sprout. <laughs> Letty, I'm so glad, honey. Thank you. Okay. I'll report a symbol in the shed. So shed, symbol, Minus red three, okay. I'm so busy trying to make sure that something's not stinking up on me. Oh, that scared me. Okay, so let me ask you this. Do we have a door manipulation here also? Because remember the door shuts a little bit when we get the, um, Okay, so writing on the porch, we have porch writing. Come on, yep. Minus blue three. Hello, Gino. This is a really cool spot the anomaly difference, like a spot the difference but it's scary and it has a little twist. Okay. Camera malfunction and path. So I think when we, my flashlight goes out, I think it's almost like we're on a time crunch. Okay, so camera malfunction driveway. Uh, 
No, I did not. Uh, minus red two. So we have. Um, ch -ch -ch. Did you get the? No. Okay. So, all right. I need. Um, okay. So what do we have here, everybody? Because I I'm I'm trying to keep up. I'm trying to keep up, but what do we have here? Okay, Lucky. So we have marinara there. Okay, so we have marinara on the porch. Yep, I have that one. We're going to put that one in right now. So minus green four. So where am I going? A gravestone missing? Okay. Okay, so I have gravestone missing. Open door in the porch. Okay. Nope, the gravestone wasn't missing, but we will do... Porch, okay, door manipulation. I hear it walking up behind me. Okay. That scared me. Sam, oh, camera path is camera malfunction. If y'all just joined, this is called Death Watch, and it's a spot the anomaly difference, minus blue. Okay, so it's five, blue five. To spot the anomaly difference with a twist because I'm being hunted by an entity while we're trying to spot the difference, and it's actually really cool. <gasps> oh, shit, everybody. Okay, I have two more. Okay, I lost my flashlight. That means we have to hurry. Sauce on path? Okay, got it. Minus green one. Oh, we only need one more. We only need one more. Oh, we have a ghost orb. We have a go. We have graveyard. Graveyard orb. Where's your orb? Where's your orb? Come on, come on, come on. We just need one more. We just need one more. Oh, I see something. We have an entity in the shed. We have a shed entity. No, I, ha I need one more red. No, there's a five, six. Okay, so it's six, three, five. So it's six, three, five. We did it. We survived. 
awesome sauce. Okay, hold on. Because I can make your screen smaller. I can bring this in a little bit. Elizabeth, thank you for my, thank you. Okay, I just, it makes it a little bit smaller. <gasps> Gino, thank you for my confetti. Yeah, do you want to play it again? I thought that was fun. Angel, thank you for my marvelous confetti. Yeah, no, I thought that was a lot of fun. All right, Sniper Kitty, thank you for my amazing confetti. Uh, yeah, the six, yeah, you get the full screen. Ah, Elizabeth, thank you for my, my, my TikTok gun. Yeah, if you turn your phone's full screen, you can see everything. If you keep it portrait mode, a little bit of the sides might be cut off. All right, let me go to the bathroom and we will do this again. Good night, Leaf. I appreciate you and get some sleep. And thank you for my donut, honey. I appreciate that. All right, I'll be right back, everybody. Mm -mm. Oh, thank you, Lucky. This is an amazing community. Hello, Latonya. How are you? Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Fashion is like such a creative outlet for me. Okay. Aw, Marisol, thank you so much. F-Y-T, F-T-Y, no, F-T-W. I can't even pronounce um, letters tonight. Thank you for my high bear. All right. Now for, um, it's actually like, I'm glad. And that's the way it should be. You should 
um, self-expression. I mean, oh, I wonder if we can, oh, if we activated the other one. To me, fashion is just nothing more than self-expression. All right, everybody, let's get going. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Let's get going and see what we can see. It's raining now. Uh-oh. It wasn't raining the last time. I think, you know what? I think, let's see. Oops, I went too far back. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah. Oh, I love photography too. Um, uh, oops, not yet. I think. Main menu, start game, normal. Oh, we can. Oh, we have a new one. Mm, good eye. Supernova, how are you, honey? Um, yep, we do. We do, we do, we do. All right. Oh, look, I'm in a new house, too. <gasps> Creepy. Look, we have a new house. Awesome. Uh oh, I hopefully um hopefully our little baby bean is here. Nope. Our little bean sprout is not with us. Okay, let's go everybody. Ooh, kitchen. We are moving up. Well, it's shut for now. Let's, uh, we won't get too ahead of ourselves because you know that's going to change here soon. Okay. Oh. Well, that's different. Okay. Okay, I have my bed. I have some pictures. Clock says that. <laughs> it's perfect. I, a lot of people fall asleep to my stream, and I think that's totally cool. Okay, let's go, everybody. Okay, was, was, uh, oh, there's somebody staring at me. Look, there's like an entity looking out of the cabinets. Can you see that? But look at the eyes. There's eyes coming out of the cabinet. We just got a flood watch. So what was that one called? That's the kitchen. And entity. I will. I'm like I said, we're up on a hill, so we're pretty. Um, I'm I'm not really hundred. I'm not too too worried about it. I just worry more about the trees and the wind. Jersey, yeah, no. Um, my son and his girlfriend live there too. Okay, is there a problem with the light here? Wasn't this lighter last time? Oh, Letty, that's really cool. I like that. Um, yeah, 
I'm going to say there's something in the landing. I'm going to say there's something in like a lighting, something with the lighting didn't look right. Yep, okay. Okay, so the clock just changed time. So I don't know if that's something. Oh, well, this one does, oh, there's two of those instead of one. So my location, I have an extra object. But it was like a lot. It was like four hours. Okay. All right. And. Oh, wow. Did you know that we're number 77 on the uh, on the gaming right now? Ah, I just think that's pretty cool. That's going to be our code to get out. Okay, we just heard in the bathroom, there's a couple of things in the bathroom. In the bathroom, I heard an audio threat and the symbol in the toilet. Yep. So mine is blue six. And then in the bathroom, a symbol. Ah, thank you, Caitlin, for my hand heart. I love you too. Minus red one, okay. Oh, was there always, there was always two candles, right? Oh, hello, Mr. Well, I'm glad I looked when I did. So let's report this location and entity sighting. Hello, sir. Okay. So let's get going. <gasps> Wani, remember to breathe. Remember to breathe. Okay. Yeah, he did. Oh, attic two lighting. He did not need to run up on me like that. You know, Brandy, this one has a um, like a duplication. So let's look. Hold on. See, and here's my question. Was there always two vents there or should there just be one vent? Does anybody remember that? I already, yeah, I got the two crosses. Yep, I already got that one. Um, Julia, there's, I mean, there's a couple of times where like a ghost will run up on me, but it's nothing too bad. Living room is a light. We have lighting is something wrong. Okay. Okay, let's look around, let's look around. We got the two there. Our door's open. Okay, let's keep looking, everybody. Yeah. Okay. Let me know if you see anything. Let me know. Rating on the kitchen wall, let's look. Yep, you got that one. So kitchen, writing. Yep, 
Yep, yep, yep. Good eye, everybody. Good eye. Minus blue five. Okay. Well, let's just don't mind me while I am trying to find out if something is sneaking up behind me. I'm just going to do this. I'm just going to do this. I'm just going to look around. Just going to make sure nothing is coming up and to going to attack me. Okay. Yeah, there was a symbol in the toilet. So we have this. We have this. Bedroom. Oh, was that always knocked down in the attic? Bathroom was always green, yes. Okay. Okay. This rain is like so soothing. Yeah, I know me too, Lucky. I forgot that I was supposed to look. I was very intrigued in what I was. Oh. That's what happens when I don't look enough. Okay, let's keep looking. Oh, there's a Ouija board there, too. Okay. Oh, bathroom camera malfunction. Minus blue four. You know, I saw it. I just don't know if it was always there. So we can report it just to see if that's something, if that's like a new object. Not a hundred percent sure. Okay, let's go. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. Oh, we have blood in the living room, or marinara sauce, I should say. So the living room has marinara sauce. Okay, then I'm going to put um, in the living room, we're going to have um, an extra object. Let's see what it says. No, I think that Ouija board might have always been there. Marinara, writing in the attic on the bookshelf. Okay. I will go look at that because there's actually two attics, so I'll have to figure out if it's attic one or attic two. I'm just saying, let's go look. So, attic two, okay. Attic two has writing. So far, my, I think my favorite game right now, red minus three, is between Phasmophobia and Granny. I really do like both of those. Mm -hmm. I don't know, Vanessa. You know what? I keep on telling you, no ghost ever haunts uh, like a two-bedroom condo. Nope, nope, and nope. They take the biggest houses and then they haunt those. Just 
do 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 we see anything do we see anything yeah or one bedroom apartment exactly or like a car you know it's like hi this is my car it's haunted um t baby i'm actually for wild card wednesdays we're playing that one tomorrow oh there's a body under there. Is there a body under the desk? Do you see what I'm seeing? I think there's a limb. Yep, that's what I was thinking. So that's the landing. Unless it's Christine. And I actually really like that one. Um, body. And. Nope. That one says that we were incorrect on our thought but uh, that looked like a body to me that looked like a body to me that looked like a body to me gaming at number 77 and i know that's not that big of a deal but it kind of makes me feel good so i keep an eye on that number oh jiminy crickets I think the more we play this, like the other maps that we unlock are going to be, it's, I think it's going to get harder the, the more we play. That noise scared me too. That one scared me also. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm climbing that ladder. One bean at a time. Oh, did I? Okay. So Attic 2 has a camera. Okay, in the dining room. Okay, dining room has marinara. Thank you, Letty. Okay, so let's look and see. I'm going to go back and try to report that one as a limb um, instead of uh, marinara. So let's see what I can do. Let's see what I can do. I'm going to try to win this one for us. Or we're going to try to win this one for us. So that one was... That one was the landing area. The landing area has victim and limbs. Okay. Okay. Oh, and that one was uh, minus green four. Okay. <gasps> Elizabeth, thank you for my superpower. I appreciate each and every single one of you. So tomorrow is Wild Card Wednesday. So that means it has no idea what we're going to play, but it's going to be fun. And so far, what I have in store is our goose game, and we're going to play 60 seconds. And above and beyond that, I have no idea. It's Richie Fox, I appreciate you. See, thank you so much. I, I really appreciate that. Thank you for the compliment. Wild card Wednesdays. You just never know what we're going to do. Wild card Wednesdays. <laughs> I know, I'm excited for Walter also. We might do some Sims and just see if, like, I, I can't do voiceovers and, like, talk for them instead of them, what, what they're actually going to say. Yes, today's Terrifying Tuesday, and, and Thursday is Throwback Thursday. And then we're going to finish, um, 
We're going to play Killer Frequency again. Richie, thank you so much for the subscription. Wow, thank you, honey. I appreciate you. Richie, welcome to my bean family. I love having you here. I love having you be my bean. And thank you, Richie, for being in my bean family. Ah, bedroom marinara. Okay. Yes, no, White, we are doing uh, Throwback Thursday. Oh, wow. So we have more. Living room is more. Writing in the living room. Okay. Minus red five. Living room. Writing. Catherine, thank you for hearting me and my teen bracelet. Minus blue. Okay, we only have to do some greens, everybody. We only need to do the greens. We only need to do the greens. We, let's go look. Kitchen, kitchen had writing, dining area. We haven't seen much stuff in here. Landing, bathroom. Oh, we have a victim in the bathroom, everybody. I would like to report a victim in the bathroom. Okay, so the writing in the dining room has writing. Got it. Got it, got it. Minus green one. Ooh, we're almost there. We need like three more. Um, yeah, I, I put the second one in there. I put the second one in there. Oh. Oh dear, I just lost my flashlight. I just lost my flashlight, everybody, and I'm super scared. And I hear knocking on my door. And I heard knocking on my door. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I think like something's up with this table. I'm going to say missing objects on this table. Tegan, how are you? Yes, I, I've reported blood in there twice. Yep. Good job. Oh, two more times, everybody. Two more times. Yes, I got the writing in the dining room. Jay Money, how are you? Ooh, victim in the attic one. Attic one, victim. Minus green six. We only need one more. I only need one more. Okay, keep an eye, victim in the bathroom floor. I got the victim in the bathtub. I got that victim. We got this, everybody. Oh, let's hurry. Um, don't see any writing there. Symbol on the kitchen table. Writing on the kitchen table in living room. Oh, yep, living room writing. Okay, let's do this. Living room writing. 
Come on, come on, come on. <gasps> no. Oh, gosh darn it. Which I think it is. I know. Living room, let me try again. Living room, writing. Oh, symbol, symbol. Okay, got it. We had to write the symbol. Minus green, so it's 651. 651, everybody. Oh, come on. So six, I hear it walking. <sighs> Hello, Riley. <coughs> All right, we did it again. Well, we're playing the maps on easy to, or on normal. But the next time we play this, we're going to be playing on the more difficult one. On the next time, we're going to be playing on Nightmare. So get used to the easy stuff because it's not staying that way. Now, if it's all good with you all, I was just going to um, end out the night with this game, if that's cool with you all, if you're enjoying it. Okay, cool. <laughs> I love that. Of course, baby. Okay, Hellbound Hospital. Awesome. Well, chill would have been too easy. Okay. Oh. Oh, wow. My flashlight does not work very well. Y'all, I don't feel very comfortable sitting in this hospital all by myself. So I just would like to let you know that I am apparently set up in this hospital and it's pretty creepy. So we have... Um, so each time we play this, there's this another room. And this time we have three, six, we have nine rooms. So let's get to looking. Yep. Okay, so that's, there's candles. They're always doing something with candles, everybody. The drawers are open, a couple of desks. All right, I'm not really too thrilled about the, the sleeping situation here. Mm. Yeah, there's a lot of creepy stuff in this one. All right, this is fun. Okay, so let me look around again. Because with my very weak flashlight, let's look for writing on the walls. Don't see any of that. Let's look for something around here. Okay. All right, let's go back. So we have the candles, the bathroom. Oh, you, uh, there was just nothing about that setup that made me feel comfortable. Okay. Is the lighting weird on this one? Doo -doo. Okay. So we have all of this. I hear somebody walking behind me, so I'll be right back.
was that bed always there like that? <laughs> yeah. Is there an arm? An, in which one? In here? Okay. Okay. Do you think I should report that as an uh, extra object? Okay, Elizabeth. Arm was not in here. Okay. All right, let me just report this really quick. Extra object, Ooh, extra object, there we go. You are correct, okay. And we have all of this. Let's see. Oh, that bathroom door is open. I don't believe that bathroom door was open again. I'm going to... Do you? Do you think that it was open before? Okay. That's what I was thinking. The stall was open. I, I didn't think the stall was open. Okay. Okay. This one's going to be tough. Which arm is the, what room is the arm in? I know you keep, I, I'm sorry, I just don't see it. And unless you let me know what room the arm is, I don't know which room to report it. Under cabinets, okay. All right, everybody, look for a room that has an arm in it. Oh, I see what you're talking about. Are you talking about this one right here? Okay, well, let me go ahead and report that, and we will see. So we're going to report um, operating room, body, limbs and body. We'll see if that's an arm, because I saw what you were looking at finally. No, I think that might have been, it probably looks like it was something else, but that was a good eye. Good eye. Oops, camera in bath. So the bath has a camera malfunction. Camera malfunction in the bathroom. No, I've never played that, but I have seen it on Steam. I've seen it on Steam. And then I have another couple of really good ones. Um, and this month, there's another Backroom Games that's coming out next week. And then after that, Pacific Drive is coming out. And we'll be playing that one also. So we have some really good games coming up. Some really good games coming up. I already bought Pacific Drive, so. Oop. Reception has a lighting area. <laughs> like just sing like random sentences. Yeah, that sounds like something I would do. Minus green too. My room has a purple light. Okay, not anymore. All right. But a little bit more serious. Okay. Good night, T-Baby. I will see you tomorrow for some Walter. 
Walter the Goose. And I'm super excited for it. Okay, y'all, I think there's somebody staring at me at, through that door in the bathroom. But look at the little thing staring out of the... Right, but look at the little thing staring out of the stall. There is, isn't there, Sam? Or is that the toilet? Okay. I will take your word for it. What room has the blood on the wall? This is lighting in the bathroom. Bathroom, lighting, storage, okay. Um, doesn't say storage, so let's go look. Uh-oh. I don't like that. Nalia, you need to, did you turn your phone sideways? I still haven't found a storage room with blood on the wall, so I'm looking. Um, the reception. Oh, right there. Got it. All righty. Reception room has a little marinara sauce. We got marinara. Um, oh, okay. Minus red six. Oh, that one was hard. You are, Kara. You got gifted a bean. That one was way harder than the last two. You guys, I'm going to, um, since it's like starting to really come down, I'm going to go take Indy out to go to the bathroom really quick. And then I'm going to do this, but it's going to be raining really, really hard once I'm done with my stream. So can you give me just like five minutes and I'm going to get Indy out to go to the bathroom and then I will be right back. So I'll be right back. Dog mom first. Absolutely. Okay.
Okay. Hello, everybody. Okay. Yes, she got a little treat for going potty. Okay. You know what? I started playing that one, and I'm not too sure about the gore content. So I'm going to continue playing it, and I'm going to see how gory it is. All right, let's go. Let's do this again. Okay. Okay, ready everybody? Okay, we have the toilet looking at us. All right, so I can't see that bad. Let's see, let's keep going. You're like, pay attention, everybody. Okay, it's raining. The boards are there. Could you imagine doing this one on hard? Do -do. All right, let's get back to it. Um, yeah, you can ask me anything, Snow White. Okay, what did that say? That just said something. Summer 58 is done by the same maker of Father's Day, which I thought was not too gory. But um, it, I'm still going to double check it. Okay, so Snow White says, okay, so I'm thinking of getting my first pair of docks for my birthday in June and possibly a tattoo. <gasps> yes, please do. Marinara in the operating room. Okay. Operating room, marinara. Got it. I would hope you would, honey. No, it says no for the marinara um, in the operating room. Victim in room in bathtub. Okay. Let's look. Is there somebody in there? Um, yeah. Yep. So that's what I was thinking. Um, good night, Mackie Doodle. Yeah, it's just the shackles. So I was, I really liked Father's Day. I thought that that was an excellent movie that was very scary has some questionable content. So I was going to play a little bit more of the Summer of the 58 just to double check that. I would definitely do the um, 1460s in Napa leather, and I would do black, and I think that you will not have any problems. And you, the thing is, is that for, for your Doc Martens, not only is it the leather, but it's the fit. And if you don't get your Doc Martens in the right size, you're never going to break them in properly and they're never going to be comfortable. So just make sure that you get them fit properly where they fit snug, but they're not too tight. Um, and then you should be fine with just a pair of 1460s um, and just the black ones and you should be good to go. Uh, 
I counting to six. I've looked at that one too, Elizabeth. And as much as I want to play them, I want to make sure that we don't have anything excessive. But I think that they both look very good for like our screaming Saturdays. Um, there was blood in the room. Okay. Do, do. In the operating room? No, that's supposed to be there. Because I reported that one and it said that that was supposed to be there. Okay. What part of the leg would you say is the least painful to get a tattoo? What part? I mean, do you want it to show like in shorts and stuff? Because uh, calves are, are, I would not recommend a calf tattoo. Not at all. Reception lighting. Um, I would say like more down the front, like like towards your foot. I mean, it's it's a tough one. There there's not a whole lot of there's not a whole lot of spots on your legs that are going to be completely pain free. But if you want it on your leg, Snow White, to where you can see it when you're wearing shorts, I would put it. Uh, I would put it. Not on your calf, but more towards like the, like bring it around from your calf towards the front of your leg. That's where I would put it. Yeah, then I would definitely just stay away from your calf. Stay away from your calf. Stay away from your knee. Stay away from your knee ditch. Um, Robert has one on his thigh and he said that wasn't bad at all. Yeah, um, yeah, calves are, I put my calf up to number one or number two of my most painful tattoos. I have one behind my ear. Blood in here. Okay. Oh, darn it. That's so cool. Mine is green. Got it. We got one, everybody. Yay, we got one. Mm, I'm not too sure how you can check that, to tell you the truth. Mm -hmm. I don't know why a tattoo would scar. Maybe Lucky would know. Well, Lucky is our resident tattooist. Yeah, I did my first tattoo around my ankle, and it was um, it wasn't fun, but it wasn't horrendous. Good night, Spooky Bear. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm looking for more. Do, 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 do. I'm looking for more. Writing in my room? Okay. Well, that don't sound very good. Minus green four. <laughs> that scared me. Okay. 
Keep looking around, Lonnie. Keep looking around. Blood outside on the ground. Oh, yeah. Good job. So the entrance has some marinara. Keep on thinking I see eyes. Lighting in my room. Okay, so there was a symbol in bathroom. I hear something behind me. Okay, minus green six, okay. Let's see what we got, let's see what we got. We got, we got, we got. Let's see what we got. Oop, shock therapy. Shock therapy is a camera malfunction. Okay, minus green one. Let's see here. Got that going. Okay, let's keep going. <gasps> FTW, thank you for my tiny dinies. I appreciate you very much. This is a spot the, um, this is basically a spot the difference kind of anomaly game with a twist because not only are we looking for anomalies, but I am trying to defend myself from a um, ghost that's trying to get me. So it's, it's a pretty interesting game. Symbol in shock room, okay. Let's try it. Yeah, it's been a lot of fun. Okay, it was correct, but they just want more information. Doo -doo. I like these kind of games too. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going. I'm okay, so that would be audio on the entrance. So the entrance it has Gore Audio. Hello, Tia, how are you? So mine is blue too. Um, FTW says blood. Where was the blood at? What Do you know what room that was in? Outside, yeah, we got the blood from outside, unless there's more. That scared me. Yeah, because I got the blood down by the bench. Oh, I think this has a duplicate now. Entity and office, okay. And 
the key in office behind you. Oh, there ah, we got it again. This one's hard. This one is definitely hard. We just have to spot the anomalies. We just have to spot the anomalies. We just have to spot the anomalies. Hospital has more rooms. Yes, it is harder. All right, you guys, we are going to end on one more game. Um, staring at this screen has given me a little bit of a headache, so I don't want to, I don't want to stare at that much longer. So I'm thinking, what about false dreams? We'll do one round of false dreams and then we will call it a night. What do you think about that? What do you think about that? We got false dreams. We got false dreams. They're dreams that are not real because they're false. I actually like false dreams. It's a pretty light, it, it kind of like, I don't know, it cleans my palate of like fighting ghosts all night long. So I like that. I like this one. Alex, we'll be doing the other one again. We got false dreams. All right, so this is, again, another Spot the Anomaly game. Much smaller version. And what we do is when we find an anomaly, I take a picture of it, and we get to check out at 9 o'clock at night or at 9 o'clock in the morning. So... Thank you, Elizabeth. It was actually a pretty fun game. I really like that one. And I will have this uploaded to YouTube tomorrow afternoon. Or even maybe tomorrow morning. It all depends on how... Oh, damn it. The little Furby is missing. All right, everybody. Let's, let's find this little effer. He's been hiding right there. I don't know why I think it's a guy. But it's been hiding right there. Where are you at, you little huffer? Yep, can't catch a break with the Furbies now, can I? Can't catch a break with the Furbies. Where is it? It's not on the ceiling. Is it outside? No. The fridge. Where'd this little SOB go? He hangs out on the ceiling. Is Angel still on? Do, do, do. Hi, Psycho Chef. Psycho Chef, thank you for my rose, Psycho Chef. That's okay, Letty. You never know until you try, right? Oh, uh, okay. And Snow White, you can always um, DM me if you want. If you ever have any questions, just shoot me a question. I will. Oh, there it is. Okay. So now I'm going to have to hide from it once I take a picture of it. So let's figure out. Okay. Just seeing. I just wanted, I didn't know if. Oh, is that it? Usually I have to hide from it. That's pretty cool. 
two o'clock. Here we go. How are you feeling, by the way, these days? How are you feeling, Angel? Two o'clock. Furby's there. It sounds like it. Doc Martens and tattoos. I think that that's really awesome. And you know what? I 100% support you. Have you been going to work or are you able to like call out and try to get better? Snow White, sometimes we just need to redo. And when you do a redo, make sure you do it exactly the way. Write your own rules and live by those rules. There's that. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, and you know what? And truthfully, finding your style and just allowing yourself to be yourself helps a lot in overcoming a little bit of depression. I know myself, sometimes I'll wake up in the morning and I'll be like in a funk and then I'll make myself like kind of push my, is the toilet seat was, the toilet seat should be down, right? Yes, toilet sheet, seat should be down. Um, but I'll push myself to uh, wear like an outfit that I feel like I'm like really kind of pushing and it gets me out of my funk. So I'm really proud of you. I think that that shows a lot until, I think it shows a lot of self-love and I would like to commend you for that. I'm sad that I look in the mirror and see my outfits looking um, good and I feel better. Absolutely. I think I would, you know what, truthfully, if I dressed the way that society told me to dress or if I did my hair, my makeup, or my tattoos the way society said to do it, I would be freaking depressed. You know what? I wouldn't be here. Oh, thank you, Snow White. Thank you so much. And you know what? You've been a you've been a really good friend on here for me and somebody who's been with me for a very long time and I I hope you know that you inspire me uh, you inspire me also. <laughs> And thank you, um, thank you, Periota. I always call you Periota, and I know that that's not right, but you are forever gonna be my Periota. Toilet paper, let's go look. Oh, you are correct, there's too much toilet paper. Too much toilet paper. Oh, you were. Seems like a lifetime ago that we were doing that. You know that? I mean, and I don't mean that in a bad way, but I look at how far I've come in this journey. And I, I just really, really, you know what? I just, and I say this all the time, but I really hope you do know how appreciative I am that I don't think I would be here without you. And I don't know if you know how monumental that is to me because you were the only person who, I mean, you stuck by me, you helped me, you guided me, you showed me kindness and you showed me friendship and I really wouldn't be here without you. So uh, it's, it, it's something that, you know, you say I help you, well, you have helped me, so. <laughs> it's the truth, you know, um, the slippers, oh, that's right, they are doing something weird, good job, yeah, and it's, um, I just remember how scared I was, and no matter how scared I was or, 
or how I thought people were going to perceive my channel or even me gaming, I always felt like if you were there and you were you were supportive, it didn't matter what anybody else thought. So, yeah, because I mean, it's like y'all have to remember. I mean, I I've been doing this now for about five months, but five months ago. It was literally three people. It was me, Snow White, and Courtney. And every once in a while, you know, Angel would come in, and it was just, it, it was, it didn't take off. And it's not that Angel didn't want to be here, it's just that nobody knew I was doing it. And so it was like, we would just be like, I mean, it was just hard to push past that. So... Ah, oh, that's my little sentimental one. Yeah. Yep, and then I started growing, and then Angel um, started moderating for me, and it just, it kind of just picked up and grew from there. Hello, Daisy. And now I have a family of beans, and um, you each inspire me in your own individual way. And like I said, I might not... Um, respond to every single comment but I see just about 90% of them and I see your struggles and I see what you're going through and I see you all supporting each other and I um, you inspire me a lot that way too I will always have fun memories of that too and you're going to make me cry and maybe I'll get a hollow night tattoo because that was like so monumental but, oh you are absolutely correct. We have some jello in the sink. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Like I said, I appreciate each and every single one of you. I do, I do, I do. Well, I thought the games that we played today were really fun. And I think for Terrifying Tuesday, I think we got to play some scary games that were not um, gory or icky. And I am okay with that. I am 100% can keep playing scary games so long as they're like this. No, actually Marinara is, but that one looked way more like Jello than Marinara. Light fixture is too big. Is that one too big? Um, Angel says, I love being here and hanging out and um, being helpful. Well, yeah, and you know what? And it's just, we have just a really cool spot. And I appreciate you. Okay, I know it's something. I know that sometimes this is, oh, the, fr yep, that's what it is. Yeah, I remember um, when I first started and I was just sitting there and talking to everybody after work, you were there. You've been with me for a, a very long time. Good morning, Paige, how are ya? Well, thank you. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Okay, his little beady eyes are not following me this time. I'm appreciating that. I'm appreciating that. So for some of the um, Throwback Thursday games, what are some of the games that you think would be fun? Oh, the boxes are too big. What do you think some of the box, uh, what do you think some of the games would be? Gauntlet, that's a good one. I guarantee you no other streamers out there are sending messages to people asking how they are. I do do that. 
<laughs> well, thank you, Angel. Okay, 8 o'clock. Sims 2. Ah, that's a good one because you know what? I've been thinking about wanting that one. Tattletale, yep. Crash Bandicoot, that's so good. The Sims, yeah. Sniper Kitty, thank you for hurting me. That is a... Um, because like I said, I want to do The Sims so long as I can do it like I do Fears to Fathom. Because you know like how when um, how the guy says goons and stuff like that, I want to be able to make fun of them. And I don't know if that like if that makes me a bully, but I want to make fun of The Sims. And I just don't know if you would enjoy that or not. Well, we have a tub full of marinara. Okay, yeah. Um, Sims 2, you can trap them like a saw game. I think you just sold me on it. Oh, gross. Oh, gross. Oh, there's a learning curve? Uh, I don't know. Can I, like, do my little Sims thing and hire another Sim to build my house for me? No, I'm, I'm not going to look over there. Oh, there's no learning curve for Sims. Okay. It's super easy. All right. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, we will do something like that. Like I said, it's going to be Wild Card Wednesday, and I'm super excited for that. All right, you guys, so that's going to be our stream for the day. That is my seven hours. I appreciate you so much, and I hope that you all had as much fun doing this as I did today. I, again, I would love to have all of your thoughts and your suggestions for any sort of games, leave it to me, or not leave it to me, but leave it on Discord. Um, and just as much as this is your best part of the day, this is my best part of my day. And I really hope you realize that. Um, and I had so much fun. So I'm going to jack myself up on some sugar tomorrow. We're going to be playing the goose. We're going to be doing 60 seconds. Um, Snow White, my friend, I, again, I am so proud of you. I just love and I appreciate each and every single one of you. We got 10 new subscribers. We have 73 new followers. And we got um, 6,200 views on our live. And I am ranking at 81 right now. So I think that's amazing. I love you all. Please be safe. I know the weather's been a little weird out there, but be safe, dress warm. I love you dearly. Ah, Lucky, thank you for my Henry. Look at how cute he's just walking across the stream. And he's all like, shoo. All right, I appreciate you all very much. And again, I will see you tomorrow. Love you dearly, everybody. Bye. Thank you, Lucky, for my hand, heart. <gasps> Good night, everybody. I love you. I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye, everybody. Oh. Hold on. We just got... Hmm, hmm, hmm. Choo -choo. How do I do that? Oh, well. All right, everybody. Um, okay. I was just looking at some new um, things that TikTok... No, no, no. I was just looking at some new um, things that TikTok was telling me about the live stream, and I was trying to figure out if I wanted to do it, but we'll do it tomorrow. I will see you all then. Love you dearly. Bye, everybody. Bye.